beautiful nerds. We are the Lost Caravan RPG, where we do one-shots, we do mini-campaigns, and we do long-running campaigns. If it's TTRPG, we use it to kill our friends after being stuck in traffic for four hours. Um, it's been a day, folks. <laughs> with that being yeah, said, for it. <laughs> tonight we're going to be running some uh, holiday 5e for you guys. Um where some of Santa's naughty list have ended up at the North Pole. They don't know why. They don't know how to get out. Maybe they'll find out. Um, there's obviously a reason that they're on the naughty list. Um, hero points and villain points are going to be a little different tonight because we're all villains here tonight. The bad guys, the good guys, we're all villains. Um, so our villain points are going to give our... Their, uh, our naughty list uh, disadvantage. You can either choose the disadvantage or I can. Um, and the hero points will allow one of the players to get an advantage, not necessarily advantage on a roll, but they can use that hero point to find out information about either the monsters or the other players, like how many spell slots they have, um, if they're weak to anything, um, so that'll be pretty interesting. I'm hoping we get some hero points so that we can see how they're going to use it. Um, we have two sponsors tonight, the first being Hero Forge. Uh, it's the site we use to make all these naughty tokens. Um, it's where you can go to get super customized minis that you can have sent straight to your door. Uh, you can use the link hopefully in chat, because that's usually my job, but here I am. Um, and it helps to support us. Um, our second sponsor is Epidemic Sound. It's the it's what we use for royalty-free music and sound. It's what you'll be hearing all night tonight. Um, I think I've got a good, like, upbeat holiday music, but there's some creepy stuff in there, too. Uh, you can click the link to get 30-day free subscription. Uh, if it turns out that you don't like it or it's not for you, you can cancel it. But if you uh, decide to keep it, it supports us. And as Hoop always says, we heckin' love you for it. Um, upcoming games. Oh, wow, this is packed. Uh, tomorrow's Pathfinder Pleasure. from James is canceled. Um, but... We'll be back Sunday for Lancer Day with the Necromancers. Uh, Monday the 12th, we have Monster Care Squad. Tuesday the 13th is Through the Breach. Wednesday, we have some Icon. Then Thursday is Morkborg with the wonderful Fleef. And Friday, we'll be back with 10 Candles. Whew, that's a lot. Uh, but if you want to roll some dice with us, uh, January is going to be just as packed. Um, you can click the Discord link down below. Um, and just come be beautiful, awesome nerds with us. Um, those were a lot of words, and I'm tired of hearing my own voice. Uh, so why don't we uh, get introduced to some of our players and have them tell us where we can find you who you'll be playing, and why you're on the naughty list. Um, let's get this chaos started right and uh, start with Jason. Right out of the gate, huh? <laughs> right out of the gate. <laughs> I'm Jason. Uh, I also go by Graphical Ronin. I am a graphic designer, illustrator who's open for commissions. I am playing um, Grimble Thimbleshanks. Who is on the naughty list for altering the naughty list? Unauthorized. <laughs> He's a ninth level rogue. <laughs> <laughs> do you need anything else for me? Or are we passing it on? <laughs> oh, nope. Uh, let's see. Who do we want to do next? Let's go with Nissa. Hello, everyone. Can you hear? I can, but let's. <laughs> All right. Uh, so we were having a little bit of closed caption chaos. So, <laughs> sorry about that, folks. 
Uh, so today I am playing Hans Gruber, as many of you may know, Hans Gruber is from Die Hard. And with Hans Gruber, pretty much I picture him. He has fallen off of the Nakatomi Plaza. Spoiler alert if you haven't seen the movie. Sorry. And uh, <laughs> he pretty much he has fallen through a magic vortex portal so that he has turned into a Ginzianki and has pretty much ended up right here. So he is tired. He's had a rough day and he just wants to find whatever the heck is going on and maybe get back and get revenge on John McLean. Uh, let's go with uh, Rindus. Hi, I'm Rindus of uh, Party Wipe Games. I am playing a character that does not have a beard, uh, but I felt that it was festive enough to have one anyways. Um, today, I will be playing the oncoming Storm. She is the one who knocks, um, or they are the one who knocks. Uh, they are an astral elf uh, wizard slash cleric uh, that definitely doesn't give away their theming with their name. Um, the reason they're on the naughty list is definitely tax evasion. <laughs> I mean, that sounds about right. It's I mean, a good reason to be on the naughty that list. Says. That'd get you on the list. Get you on the list. <laughs> I mean, um, Santa Santa's Village is a communist commune, but <laughs> you're not incorrect. <laughs> hmm. Who should be next? Hmm. Let's go with Neop. Oh, hello, hello. Can everybody hear me? Yeah. There you go. Uh, I'm Neop, Neop Tres. Uh, today I'll be playing a Juguete, an ex soldier. Toy maker whose past is coming to haunt her, see seemingly. A few good deeds in the toy making business seemingly do not make enough to get you out of the naughty list, it seems. And uh, yeah, I'm here to have some fun and some chaos. Not you, Nia. Moon Moon, what are you doing? Alright, uh, I guess that leaves, uh, Last but not least, uh, Felis. Hello, everyone. I am Undead Felis. I will be playing Harold J. Rat. A um, a couple years ago, he served the Rat King, who was overthrown after the prince got turned from the Cracker became back and overthrew the fascist government that was set up. Um, since then, he's been sort of selling his trade as a hired gun and has just done some weird war crimes. And that's why he's on the naughty list. He's just the worst one. I mean, it sounds like everybody deserves to be here. And I got another villain point. Thank you, Tessa. Um, and I am Dido. I will be your GM this evening. I get to kill all of my wonderful friends tonight. Um, we'll kill you first. <laughs> you can I, I, mean, I, I hope. I hope you'll kill me too. Because um, what are friends for? Yeah. Um, but I am Dido. I will be here quite a few times this week. Um, and I don't usually GM, so this is a little, still a little new. Um, but let's, uh, get into a, a little bit of why we're actually here. Um, we start our adventure with our characters strewn on the ground, unconscious. Snow is falling lightly, and beneath them, a powdery, cold snow. You guys have no idea how you got here, where you are, or why you're here. As you wake up, jingle bells can be heard in the distance. Melodic music, laughter, and the braying of animals. You find yourselves under an ornately decorated tree with presents all around. Small buildings surround this tree along with a larger building a little farther back and a couple of medium-sized buildings past. All the trees are decorated in lights and festivities. Who thinks they'll wake up first? <sighs> Is that a good night's sleep? Oh, what the heck? 
Hello? I think that's me out. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, what's your character's name? You? Who get the... <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to say that, so, Jay! <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> you, uh, uh, you wake up first, um, under this brightly lit tree, presence just like you've got like one like sticking you right in the rib um and uh not far from you there are a couple of uh you see a couple of other people just looks like they had a a good night and are sleeping it off what'd you like to do um I'd like to stand up and uh, look around just kind of inspect myself, see that everything is with me, nobody's stolen anything. Um, I do have my uh, companion, little steel defender, and an old. <laughs> oh, there you go, you do have fears. I'm prepared. Uh, and I want to approach the next person to my right, see who they are. That's what I want to do. Stand up, check myself, and go to next person on the right. Uh, so that would be Hans. You start feeling a poking. <laughs> Hans Starts just waking up. Han jolts upwards and immediately looks around frantically, patting himself down, wondering what the hell, because he was just falling from a very tall building and was expecting, you know, not to wake up, nor his hands are yellow. What on earth? And he looks to see this beautiful Christmas tree above him and he slowly gets to his feet and looks around and he immediately thinks he's a com in a coma. Not an unreasonable. <laughs> Not really. It seems to make sense. Fever dream, but fall back. <laughs> right? One, too many drinks. <laughs> Clearly, this is a medic. This is a medication fueled fever dream. <laughs> so many colors. Or Jesus. potentially uh, his brain neurons firing because, you know, he's either dying there or dead. On. This is the last thoughts he ever has. <laughs> <laughs> right fucking before. Dark. <laughs> oh, that one's not gonna get censored. <laughs> Hello there, uh, sir. And yeah, uh, then notice people around and we'll go over to the next person, I guess, to the north. <laughs> <All right. laughs> so, so, uh, how, how do you, um, how do you rouse off this, uh, rouse this tiny little man off the frozen ground? <laughs> He seems to be out cold. Yeah, um, uh, well, I would, I would certainly try nudging him with my foot. Yeah. So after a couple of seconds of that, he doesn't even like, he doesn't even get up. He just immediately like starts rubbing his temples while he's still laying flat on his back. He's like, "Oi, what the hell? What? Oh, god!" He starts looking around. Who are you? <clears throat> I am Hans, and you are who's the <laughs> points down? <laughs> or they? Which is it? <laughs> I don't remember. I'm sorry. <laughs> Went towards Hugate. Uh, is that how it's pronounced? Yeah, good enough. Okay. Close good enough. enough. <laughs> you 
guys don't look like themselves. Oh. <laughs> the tiny man. Oh, yeah, man. Uh. <laughs> None of you happen to know where we are, no, do you? Um. <clears throat> Would that be something uh, Grimble could, um, like, maybe make a roll on? Because he's yeah. assessed the naughty list at one point, so he's at least somewhat familiar with Christmas Town, right? Yeah, let's make our first roll. Why don't you make me a history check? Do I just click it in the foundry? Is that how it works? Yes. Okay. Ah, there we go. Uh, normal. <laughs> out, of out of it. I don't know. Could be, that doesn't could be well Candy Cane rest, Town. Though. Could be Gingerville. I don't know. <laughs> that's all these. That's all, just funny. all these towns look the same. That sounds <clears throat> preposterous. Overshadowing. Oh dear God! Is there anybody else around here? I think we're alone. <laughs> Stand up and take a couple of steps out. Ah, back around too. <laughs> I'll go over and uh, <laughs> give give uh, the rat a little nudge with my boot, which Heron's probably has a... this entire time and and pulls his gun and puts it into your shadow. <gasps> Who are you? You said, Grimble. I do not trust you. Okay. Uh, same. <laughs> do you know where we are? <laughs> do I? I am kind of. How familiar are the is was the rats and the rat king familiar with Christmas hat? I don't know. Um, well, roll. Why don't you give me a history check too? Okay. I don't. I don't, know, I don't think I'm the smartest rat in the world. Um, like I had a plus four and I still rolled a one. So history. Oh, I'm a plus two to it. I'm 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 okay. Come on, come on, feel okay. Mm. There's I, for all you know, it could be the Sugar Plum Village. Uh, for all you know. In fact, I burned the Plum Village down. Yeah, and he's just gonna have his rifle out and just kind of like go in between people. Um, and just sort of stays over there, away from them. Is there anybody else around here? Hans is gonna yeah, go off the to the side and just double check his what he has on this person. Because last time he was aware, he just had the one thing, and then is kind of shocked that he's clean has weapons, has other things that make no sense, and also trying to, over try to overcome that he has yellow skin and uh, will run a hand through his hair and then realize his ears are long and pointed and he oh, no. uh, lets off a curse in German. This has been Isekite. <laughs> <laughs> you are the most jaunty elf I've ever seen. He was hit by moments before he hit the ground. <laughs> Random truck hit them as they splatted on the pavement. Yeah, true. Yeah, true. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Um, similar, um, similar to to the rat. Um, the oncoming storm is not asleep. They're sitting cross-legged and meditating, and one of their eyes will open. Um, as you approach, it just says, salutations. It's about time you all roused. You know where we are? I do not trust you either. That's a great question. I might be able to give us an answer. If my dice won't screw me on this. Come on, come on. Yes! 23! <laughs> Finally. Well, we're um, not in Thanksgiving land. 
We're not in Halloween Town. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Obviously, Halloween overtook Turkey Land like three decades ago. <laughs> <laughs> it was a violent war. <laughs> I fought in it. The uh, the oncoming storm. You've been sitting here for a while. Um, unmoving, just watching. Um. You've seen a little bit of movement, some like small little creatures walking around. Um, but uh, they all seem to have dispersed about an hour or so ago when your other friends started dropping out of the sky and falling on the ground around you. You all took a nasty spill. Is anybody injured? Surprisingly, it's <laughs> not. Poking around, feeling around, and then like twist a big nasty pop in the middle of his back. Ah, I'm better now. Wonderful. <laughs> hmm. oh. Just just know that I can provide healing should any of you become injured. You need only ask. Oh, just that nice? No, but my services are available. Uh, that makes sense. That makes sense. Um, as you guys are standing around, um, you hear this like click. You know that like really annoying sound that really old PA systems get. That like yeah. click beep. Yeah. You guys hear that very loudly and in stereo because it comes out of each one of these houses, like by each door. You hear, "Welcome to the North Pole. We welcome you." To our village. Please feel free to make it. yourself at home. Yes, you can. He just shoots one of the speakers out of fear. <laughs> Goes out. It makes it like a like a loud like popping sound. Um, but the others uh, keep continuing. Uh, enjoy the food and drinks and make friends. You have all been chosen for a very special chance to experience everything we have to offer. Only one can make it to the big finale. But please, enjoy, and take in the majestic experience of our village. And then everything goes... I wouldn't say quiet, but back to what the the sounds as you guys were waking up are. So, like, the jingle bells and the light music. The recorded ambiance, as it were? Yes. It is just jingle bells on loop. <laughs> it's even worse. We're in the capital. <laughs> and where, pray tell, we think. Where, tell pray me. tell, do you think you are? Yes, where are we? It's the North Pole. We're it's Santa's city, Santa's village. The, you, you, you do know who Santa is, right? The the Big holiday fat fairy. Spirit. Yeah, exactly. That's the one. Jolly, Jolly Red Giant. Uh, can I insight to see if he is fudge. bullshit BSing us? Who the um? Uh, for saying little... that this is the North Grimble. Pole. Yeah. Oh, well, the, you don't have to insight him. The intercom said, welcome to the North Pole. We inside the intercom? I truly believe we are. <laughs> yes, you can incite the intercom. North Pole. <laughs> if I check the intercom. <laughs> <laughs> Who hasn't vibe checked a weird voice coming out of the walls <laughs> once or twice? Mm, it's pretty <laughs> sus. You gotta make, you gotta make sure Fair. it's real. I don't know, man. It seems kind of sus to me. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I mean, you don't you don't know what that voice was or what that intercom is, but you believe it. It did say only one of us would reach the end of the festivities. You don't think that's ominous, do you? Do you think that includes these two robots? To what? I mean, this uh, my Altoy and the little uh, and she takes uh, from her back. She takes down a like a giant version of just a. Uh, one of those classic robot toys, which is her steel defender. <laughs> like, 
Do you think they count as the, 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 of the last stand? Harold points a gun at it. Often you have to kill those that you love to achieve greatness. Perhaps they care might about live. this. Grimble pulls uh, what looks like a candy cane out of his pocket, but then he lights it and starts smoking it. Awesome. <laughs> Wild. I love this character the more I hear about him. <laughs> Wild. As entertaining Wild. as it is, ladies, and he pauses for a moment, gentlemen. I will be proceeding to look for a phone. Uh, you're probably not, Hans... not going to find a phone here. Yeah, Hans will just uh, start walking away to the uh, north. I guess the northeast. The largest building looks like the best place to start looking. Uh, the oncoming storm is going to head that way as well. Uh, you say the oncoming storm is going to be... I guess... Still freaked out, but they haven't attacked him yet. Harold's gonna follow. All right. <laughs> um, as you guys approach this uh, big house, you see that. Um, let's see if I remember how to do this. Uh, over here, um, is a door. Uh, lit with two lanterns. Um, there are three bay windows. And over by where Hans is, there are two big, like, wooden doors. Um, and as you look down, you can see where it looks like maybe some kind of animal um, comes in and out of there. Hans will go and knock on one of the two big Uh, you knock and you don't hear anything. You'll knock louder. <laughs> we're gonna oh. we're gonna do this. We're gonna move a little bit. Oh fuck! Mm. Loading the big house. Things are happening. Darkness. Smile I only see friend. darkness. Darkness <laughs> for me. All right. Are you all on here? Yeah. Here. Yes. Oh, I'm technically off map, but I like it. Oh. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Move you guys where you want. Uh, I don't think I was where over am I? Here at the point. We're at the yeah. door. I want to open the doors. Oh. Put the Wait for everybody to stop moving. That would have been where I was before the. Oh, this music, those Christmas lights, I'm getting a little so, dance club break. Someone's gonna. Oh, <laughs> what doors are you gonna open? You guys splitting the party? Uh, these look more like person-sized doors, to be honest with you. Oncoming storm is going to open this way. They won't see us and we can <laughs> kill them in their sleep. Uh, through the window, you see uh, a large lit tree. Um, you can see a desk and a chair. You might be able to see some of the light from the fireplace from where you are. Um, they'll, they'll look around the corner to, uh, to Grimble. Grimble. Uh, to Grimble yes. and and say, I don't see anybody inside. Uh, it does seem to be abandoned around here. Uh, does anyone know what night it is? What's the date? Do we know that? <laughs> it is whatever day it was that you disappeared, which is to you, it's whatever day it is that you disappeared, which I think is Christmas Day for one of you. One. Definitely for Hans, it was Christmas Day. <laughs> July 2nd. <laughs> well, last I knew it was December 24th. <clears throat> I was 
what tier? What tier? <laughs> it's a good question. Are we entering house or not? Are we just? I say we enter house. I say. Enter do you want to use the big doors or do you oh, want to use the person-sized doors? Big doors sneak in. Big doors mean big things. <laughs> what do you think, Storm? Just Follow wait. them. No, let them go first. We'll try this side. Uh, I will. Uh, I will try the door that's right here. Just without. Um, yeah. Uh, it it opens. It's, yeah, it All opens. Right. It's unlocked. <laughs> Seems to be unlocked. I walk in. <laughs> I try to. I collided with the wall. Bloop. You have to maybe move it. Ah, there's a trick to, to it. Yeah, you have to. You <laughs> actually have to walk through the door. You have to. Yeah. 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 There you go. Open the door. Karen's gonna follow these people. All right. <laughs> Over here. Okay. Yeah. Okay, Hans so will inside. try to open the one of the two big doors off. Well, uh, they're both open, and um. Yep. You, you uh, Jay was able to walk in. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Oh, but All, right. All right. Um, <laughs> as uh, as you all walk in, um, before you even get that far, whoop, I am, I still have a hold of all of you. Um, don't mess with God. <laughs> there we go. Um, all of you hear the doors behind you close and click shut. Oh boy. That oh. man's in one um, of his moods. Guns up. Rifles up. <laughs> the the three that entered through the front door. Um you see uh, a kitchen area uh, with a whole bunch of food and ingredients. Uh, the fire is still lit. Um, there's a pot hanging in the middle with what looks like stew. Um, and to the right extends a larger living room area uh, where a desk sits in a bay window strewn with papers tree in the corner, decorated in ornaments and lights, with perfectly wrapped presents underneath. Uh, there's a bookshelf on one side of the fireplace, um, and a pile of logs. And in the middle is a large, comfy, um, comfy couch. On that couch, is a hulking figure and next to the bookcase is another one that's where we're gonna leave you you guys for right now oh. yes. Move. <laughs> you guys can see those tokens i put on right yeah they look like uh like yeah i don't have actual like hoodie. yeah okay. <laughs> Um, for the two who walked in the other side. Lining the far wall are animal stalls. With a pile of presents in the far back corner. And a long table with presents underneath of it. What you guys also see kind of poking out of the stalls are these little floating beings with eyes. Floating. Uh, do they... Are they more like spectrals or are they kind of humanoid but still like floaty and bit? Roll me an intelligence check. Intelligence. 
intelligence check um they look alien uh jay i'm just with a 22 these are gazers and there are about almost a dozen of them. Oh. And as you as you look in, all of their little stocky eyes stare right at you. Just a question, what's the gazer? <laughs> um, it's, it's a, a baby beholder. beholder. It's a baby beholder. Oh. Oh, yeah. Um, and you know what? That's that's where we're gonna leave leave you guys. We're I'm gonna let you shit your pants for a minute. Yeah, we definitely picked God's a better room. I think. Close. <laughs> what? In God's name. Um. Yeah. I'm gonna. Uh, so the three of you, you see these two, um, it looks kind of like a large insect. It's got, it's sitting like a person, but it's got these, um, <sighs> these like claws that come out of the side and out. Pincers, that's what I'm looking for. <laughs> they don't seem to have noticed you yet. Can I roll uh, history or something to see if it's anything Grimble's run into before? Uh, yeah, sure. Roll me history. Uh, I'll roll a history as well. We know how, we know how well this this uh, happened last time. <laughs> Fuck it. I mean, he's a weird magical. Oh, man. that's a good one. Twenty-two. <laughs> um, you've um eighteen. All right, we will start with um, the 12. Uh, you recognize these? You've never encountered one yourself. Um, but you have a good speculation of what it is. Um, Harold and Grimble, you definitely, these are Umber Hulks. And Grimble, you know that they shouldn't be here. <laughs> Yeah, this is. You can, uh, you, this is this is an iconic chair. You know, only one person sits in that chair. Yeah, for one, these things like this isn't even in their range, man. They're like uh, they're much farther south. Uh, I have just kind of keeping it quiet. <laughs> I don't understand. That's the fat man's chair. Have they noticed us yet? You said not yet, right? <laughs> Uh, um, no, they have not noticed you yet. Let's leave. Uh, where are we gonna go? I have a feeling that door locked behind us. Did you hear the click? I may have a diversion if you're not opposed to some subterfuge. Never. Not at all. Um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna cast Mage Hand. Okay. <laughs> With Maid Chand, I'm going to have it go open uh, the door leading or on the opposite side. Okay. So that one that goes out to the. I don't necessarily uh, know that our friends are in that next room. But yeah. Do you care? Um, no. Why don't, <laughs> why don't the three of you roll me a stealth check? Ooh, I'm good. Okay. Yeah, so my. Same. <laughs> I say before rolling uh, dice. There it is. Yeah. Thank you, dice. <laughs> oh, no. I should always roll the dice before I say I'm good. Oh, oh, look, at, look at Grimble. 19. Dude. Thank you. Uh... Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> so, um, Grimble, another natural 20. Um, you're able to, like, duck, like, close to the counter. Uh, to get out of the way of any of these things seeing you. And 
Harold, being a rat, you're small too. You just kind of like crouch to the ground. Um, but uh, oncoming storm, as you go to um, unlock this door and open it, the one in the corner looks at the door, but the one that's sitting in the chair looks directly at you. Um, I need everybody to roll initiative. We've been made. Oh, joy. I am I'm gonna, with I'm gonna figure out how to start a combat. <laughs> okay, I'll let you All figure right. that before I ask my question. Learning on the fly! Ah, there we go. Let's see you roll in more high rolls. Uh, don't roll until I work? figure this out. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's one thing. <laughs> okay, I, I think I think now. you can start. I think you can roll it now. Oh. All right, that was the stealth roll. So let me. Why is that? Do you did you click on initiative under your attributes? Yeah. Use the first roll. Did mine roll at all? Because it doesn't. Seem Grimble, to yeah, yours rolled. Oh, okay. Now you the first initiative. Uh. <laughs> Oh, booyah, nat 20. <laughs> okay. 28. Okay. Oh, so many dice on the screen. Oh, goodness. Oh, no, no. Uh, it can't take much more of this, Captain. <laughs> so they're, so e they're so Easter <laughs> fest and we're in the wrong <laughs> holiday. Uh, there goes another that one. gazer, oh. stop! These are no. Oh. <laughs> So many gazer. Oh, this is a lot of eyeballs. Oh, we're gonna work oh, no. to get that this party started. Twenty. Did I have a net one? Can I use the two of them rolled in that twenty? Can I use the dirty twenty? <laughs> no. Oh. I can't say that, but I'm assuming no. What did did it change your? Uh... Initiative? You can use whatever your first initiative was. The dirty point. I accidentally rolled it like 14 times because it didn't feel it didn't seem like it was doing anything. <laughs> <laughs> initiative. Okay. Oh dear god, we are so screwed. <laughs> I did it. I'm not seeing mine in there. Uh you rolled a seven. Seven, okay. I don't, know how to change. <laughs> I don't know how to change. I don't know how to change your initiative. So you got to keep that four. Sorry. Well, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm last anyway, right? <laughs> Either whether it's a seven or a four. I don't know. Pretty darn close. Uh, but uh, Harold gets to go first. I'm so excited. So one of them has seen my has seen the oncoming storm, right? Yes, the one sitting in the chair. The gorilla-looking beetle in the chair, in the chair. has looked okay. in your friend's direction. I'll shoot it. Yeah, I'll shoot it. Uh, give me a sec. How many, how many attacks do I have at level 9? I, okay, I have two, so I'm going to shoot it twice. Um... And with my gunner feet, I ignore the loading property of um of guns. Nice. So that's fun. Welcome to uh, the club. You have an infinite crossbow. <laughs> uh, that's a twenty-eight, and I'll roll my second one right now as well. That's for twenty. Uh, <laughs> for thirty-one. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I think that's Beautiful. definitely going to be a critical hit. Yeah. Um, so damage for the first attack is 12 damage. And then the second attack uh, is 26 damage. So 38 damage. You, uh, you see this Umber Hulk just... <laughs> In its in its seat. Does it okay. die? No. It just fuck. Kind of gasps a little bit. It's just yeah. really angry now. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Um, anything? What's my bonus actions? Um, 
Um, yeah, there's nothing else I can really do right now for bonus action, so I'm just going to move away. I'm going to go over here. I just run away. Uh, and that's the end of my turn. Is gonna be the gazer's turn. The gazer is going to. It's gonna target Jay because you're the closest thing. Oh no. Which gazer is it? Let's pull this. Oh, um. Let's back one here. Go on, attack you. I don't know. Oh. Get one chance at that. The first one um, is going to hit you with a dazing ray. Uh, you need to make a wisdom saving throw or be charmed. I'm half advantage against being charmed. Okay. That's a saving throw, so I... It's a what? A wisdom? It's a wisdom saving throw. Get advantage. It needs nothing to sneeze at. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this gazer... This is, this is just a little thing. Just a little thing. Uh, and then uh, it's... Other Abel is... Uh, is gonna shoot in your direction. I need a DC 12 strength saving throw. A strength saving throw, that's a... Fudge. Uh, you get, you feel yourself get like lifted up into the air and thrown into the table. Oh, fudge, that's... Optimal. <clears throat> that's not what I was expecting yeah. to happen. And that's gonna be that gazer. Only a dozen uh, more then, to go, guys. <laughs> there's yeah, there's a bunch more to go. <laughs> oh, um. Uh. Hans, I also need a strength saving throw, please, from you, as you start to feel the, sim the uh, a similar uh, effect. No, Mr. Gruber. As you also get hit with a telekinetic ray. I feel like as long as we're on the first floor, Hans is fine. <laughs> <laughs> he is vulnerable uh, yeah. to fall damage, though. Yeah. You don't want to. You don't want to <laughs> fall again. Um, he takes D12s instead. You are muted. Right. Sorry, to be fair, it has to be at least 10 feet or higher for that uh, fall damage. <laughs> um, I need a dexterity saving throw as well. Uh, um, as you resist this force that tries to move you, you start feeling a little bit of the cold from outside seep in. He feels his uh, nipples. Um, oh no. Oh, that was a you are going to take 18 cold damage as the disadvantage from the villain point that Neop gave you doubled the damage of the first hit you would take. <laughs> oh no. True! <laughs> Maybe it's cold outside. Oh, the weather outside is right and we'll stop there. Uh, perfect storm. I'll keep saying. Or the oncoming storm. Mmm. Me. Okay. Um. Well, I wanted the Umber Hulks to go that way, but they did. So, I will send them a firebolt that has been changed to. A that door did open. You were I know, able to get the door open. But they didn't go that way because we immediately started zapping them. Um, <laughs> Which is fine. It's not a problem. Um, I am going to shoot a firebolt at them, which has now been changed into a lightning bolt because of my wizard uh, 
casting style. Zaya. Uh, which one are you hitting? Uh, chair. Chair. Yeah, because we beat up chair. Okay, so attack, roll. Hmm, 23. We'll hit. And damage. Not a critical hit, as tempted as I am to just hit that anyways. <laughs> Eleven lightning damage. It is hit with firebolt, Li uh, lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. <laughs> I got a whole theme going here. <laughs> is there anything else you'd like to do? Uh, I am going to move. Say, you've got this under control, right? No. Over this way. <laughs> oh, not you per se, but. No, I'm just answering him in general, no. Grimble looks like he's got it under control. He fought no war. It's an Arco tattoo that's shaped like a purple on the back of his neck. <laughs> <laughs> two, two sharpened candy canes crossing over a reindeer skull. Uh, Hans, <laughs> uh, you got iced, but you did also hear this door open, and you see it open. Uh, the door that's behind him, or the door that is uh, up the door end? next to Jay. All right, excellent. So Hans will just move a little bit to go and take a peek through that doorway just to see what's in there. You should be able to move your character, yeah. Oh. Oh. Mm. That Perfectly was straight with the weird. door the first time. <laughs> Yeah, sorry, um, I got the push to talk on, and apparently my shift key is just being weird with interacting with anything. Did you did you want to get right in front of the door next to uh, Jay? You know what? May as well. Okay. Yeah, because from there you can you can see both of the the big the big gorilla looking beetles that and are in Hawk there. Close the door. <laughs> okay. That's We're better in here. <laughs> Fair enough. He would like to close the door without drawing attention of the big guys. Um, that is not hard to do because it got shot, and it it got shot with lightning, <laughs> and it got shot by a rat. Okay, yeah, so he closes the door and he will look at Jay and uh, kind of say quietly so not to disturb these weird spectral things. Perhaps we should try to leave. I will see if I can open the big yes. door. Yes. I think it's safe inside here. And he will move back to the big door and see if he can figure out a way to open it or if there's a lock. He had padded down his coats and found a um, lock picks uh, set, so. Uh, roll me a thieves tools. getting there. Give me a minute. No, take your time. What are you for? Uh, 24. You you have your lock picks in there, and you know you're, you're good at what you do. You know these lock picks have gotten you into far... Far more secure places than a barn door. I am but an exceptional you, thief. But you just can't 
quite get the um you just can't quite get it to line up but very small right above the lock in faint glowing letters uh, um you start to see a small inscription you can't read it at first because it's faint and then as it starts to get darker and thicker uh it reads you must sacrifice one to open the door. <laughs> Fuck that. The screws already. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Um, and and uh, now you get a whole round to think about that. As beautiful, I love it. Uh, you're gonna get. You're gonna get attacked by both of these gazers. So I'm just gonna just gonna roll it all. Oh, oh the difference. Okay. Two ones, two fours. <laughs> and it's not like a one one four four. So they're two different two different ones. Okay. Um I need a wisdom saving throw. We'll start with that one. I feel like we're in here with Umberhawks, but it sounds like a Star Wars scene in the other room. <laughs> yeah, you guys hear zoom, zoom, zoom. Uh, so you are charmed um, until the start of this gazer's next turn. Um, your speed is halved, and you have disadvantage on any attack rolls. Um, I will also need um, a strength save as well. This is not disadvantage, because this is a saving throw, not an attack. Santa, don't play. <laughs> They're on the naughty list for a reason. I atoned for my crimes. I made toys. Fifteen, Let's you're not good. Talk you, about the socioeconomic you, you may be it. charmed, but you are. You are staying put. I also need another wisdom saving throw as the other gazer tries to charm you. Not that it really matters, but it'll just last for that much longer. All right. You are not charmed by this one. Um, and one last strength save. Nice. So oh, glad we went in the other door, guys. <laughs> right? <laughs> It's just a number Hulk. <laughs> just two it, uh, and yeah, you are perfectly fine. Nothing. You've already you've already went falling this day. Your feet are staying on the ground. Indeed. No more heights. All right. Um, this this Umber Hulk has seen its friend in the door close. It knows that there's something over here. It actually knows that all of you are over here. So he is going to start moving over here. Hey, big fella, I'm not with those guys. <laughs> and he is going to attack, attack you twice with the claws. Oh, OK. <laughs> this probably won't end well for me. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, 19? I'm pretty sure that hits. Um, where is my AC? 14's my AC. All right. All the squishies went in one room. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. You're a cleric. You're Big not squishy. So I you're going to take 11 oh, damage from the first claw? <laughs> Feelest, to be fair, I actually probably have the best AC. <laughs> is it? What's your, what's your AC? 18, because I'm a cleric, too? Yeah, so is mine. <laughs> Ah, high five. Uh, yeah. I'm, playing like, I'm playing like a wizard is the problem. Uh. Does a 17 hit? 17 does. I'm uh, 14 right. on the AC. Here I am thinking I'm delicate. However, I do have I do have an ability of some sort. Give me a second to look it sure. up. I have 
Gift of the gem, telekinetic reprisals. When I take damage from a creature within 10 feet, I can use my reaction to force the creature to make a strength saving throw, DC 14. On a failure, the target takes 2d8 force and is pushed up to 10 feet away. And that's strength? Yep, 14. Although they probably won't have an issue making that. Uh, it's 11. So he got moved right. back. And yeah, so. he just comes right back. So do I just roll that separate, or do I click that? Did that roll anything? It did not roll anything. So I believe it was what, 2d8? Uh, 2d8, so I'll just roll that manually then. Um, boom. Uh, big dogs, oh, 11. And then, uh, yeah, he didn't, he didn't oh, like that. Dice. <laughs> so he's going to come in as he comes charging back up at you. He's going to get you with his third attack. He's going to bite at you with his mandibles. That's that's going to hit. Uh, I go with a fighter. <laughs> for, for 14, 14 slashing damage. Ouch. There you go, I know it's gonna get sacrificed. Oh, I'm not having a great Christmas, guys. <laughs> uh, next is gonna be three gazers. The first two are gonna go after Jay. I have to reroll two of those. Uh, I need a DC. It's still a one. Um, a wisdom saving throw. A charm? Yep. Advantage roll. All right, you save. And also a... Another wisdom saving throw against being frightened. Another one I don't have advantage against. Touch. Frightened. You are now considered frightened. Does that do? Of this, this little guy. So that means as long as do that. Against as long as you are within line and line of sight. I will. Figure out how this. The has this Why is it? An ability to check an attack roll where the source of fear is within line of sight. Yep. And I cannot move closer. Okay. Okay. So we have one option then. So that was the fear. What was the. Another one. Uh, roll me another wisdom saving throw to not be frightened. Another one? Mm hmm. Touch. You Nothing are. But screaming in that other room. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you are also They're frightened. Dying, Darcy. You're frightened. Why? Why can I not figure out how this works? You are frightened of these two guys right here. They are in uh, and a strength game. save. Oh, I'm getting thrown again. Touch. You're gonna get thrown, and you're gonna get thrown. Thirty. You were sitting feet. on twenty for a second too. That's that's the hard <laughs> thing. <laughs> you're gonna get thrown. Thirty feet in that direction, as you just get picked up and just kind of tossed. You don't take any damage, though. Oh, okay. Um, and then this gazer closest is going to go after the one by the door, the one trying to open the door. Mr. Gruber. I need a dexterity saving throw. No, that's a lie. Strength saving okay. throw. And a wisdom save. You look strong, Hansi. 
strong enough. Yeah, you're strong enough. Uh, enough. Wisdom. <laughs> Not quite smart enough. You will be charmed until this gazer's turn. Till the start of this gazer's next turn. They are indeed charming. Uh, now we're back over into this room with this um, Umber Hulk. So it's going to use half of its movement to get up out of the chair. Um, and then it's going to start moving. Let me just double check how much movement they have. All right, that is as far as it can get. And as it gets closer to the Umber Hulk, they kind of start dancing around each other as it's gonna... I'm gonna die. And right over into here. In danger. That's gonna be his turn. Um, You know what? They really don't like this, this uh, guy at the door. A dexterity save and a wisdom save. From Hans? From Hans, please. You guys started two fights at once. I love this. All right. Uh, and I just realized for the dexterity, I have evasion. So I just realized that now. All right. Oh, fudge. It is the slowest rolling dice. But it's good. <laughs> Ooh. 20, yeah. It's good, yeah. You're good. All right, and you also needed a wisdom ah, save again? <laughs> you, already, you already made the... Uh, you already made the wisdom save. And you failed. Yeah. All right, so it was just a deck save you needed this time? Yep. Uh, Grimble. You're surrounded by gorilla beetles. Yeah. <laughs> um, and they are dancing around you. Well, and I'm still, uh, I'm still not quite in melee range with either one of them. Um, well, this one would be in your melee. Okay. Um, because it bit you. Oh, and this one was the other one was the one that was in the chair then. Yes. Gotcha. Um, boy, what do I want to do? Uh, I think I'm going to um, hit the one that was attacking me with some frostbite. I don't know. Did that roll anything? Am I doing that wrong? So you just click on it to cast it, right? Yes. That work? Yes, it did work. And is for it's a, is if it's a is that a ranged? saving throw? It's a saving throw. Uh, yes, I believe it is ranged. Um, but it's a con save, so it doesn't affect anything. Uh, I twenty. Beat it. Yeah, you beat it. Uh, it's just a cantrip, so there's no half damage. Uh, I will use um. What is it? Cunning action, I think. Disengage, right? Yeah, I'll use cunning action to disengage and tuck and roll behind this <laughs> desk. Take some cover. <laughs> just, just for, just for shits and giggles. Roll me, roll me a performance check. You got it. Uh, performance. Uh -huh. I not my cup of tea. But I'll you take stay it. Rolling a 20. <laughs> <laughs> um as you're like tucking and rolling, you're kind of like ducking, but you're moving with like the beat of the the soft music that's playing and you pick up the beat of how the other Umber Hulk walked around. Um and it doesn't regard you as a threat. And you're able to hide behind the uh, the desk without a problem. 
like when you have to step in a weird way to keep the sandworms from coming at you, dude. <laughs> move without rhythm. <laughs> in this case, you gotta move with a specific rhythm. <laughs> Is there anything else that you would like to do? Yell out, uh, dance to the music. <laughs> it's like, put my back up against this heavy desk. That's gonna be my turn. <laughs> right. Um, this last gazer is gonna gonna go after Hans. That's uh, <laughs> two wisdom saves. Okay. Seven. You are going to be charmed until the end of the next round. And six. And you are oh. frightened. Oh. You are. Oh. There's oh. a lot of screaming. You of you. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a you're, horror. <laughs> you're afraid of this gazer here, right in the middle. <laughs> Glad we picked this door. <laughs> yeah, we got Yay. these ones outnumbered. <laughs> Jerry, it's it's your turn. You're you're frightened. I don't think you're charmed, but you're frightened. Haunt is having one heck of a Christmas. This is a bad day for Haunt. He, like he thought falling off a building was bad. Hans doesn't deserve all of this. He just wanted to spread Christmas cheer. Yeah, he was just a terrorist. He doesn't deserve to get his fucking mind ruined by a bunch of fucking beholder babies. Hasn't he <sighs> suffered enough? He just yeah. wanted to steal six hundred million dollars from Nakatobi Plaza. Up, beat up by Bruce Willis. That's that's bad enough. Yeah. A cowboy. There's enough suffering. Oh. Uh, wait, it's, uh, who? It's your turn, yep. What would you like oh, okay. to do? Okay, um, I have a question. Uh-huh. I have heroism. Heroism says that I'm immune to being afraid, being frightened while the spell is active. Does that mean that the moment the spell ends, I'm back to being frightened? Um, no, because by the time heroism would end, the gazer would have already went. Because you're only frightened until the end of the gazer's next turn. Okay, then. Or the start. The start of the next turn. But you wouldn't okay, be immune to any uh, any new frightens. In that case, I would rather uh, have... Uh, how do I move? No. I will have uh, our little friend move over in this corner. Wait, how do I move to this... Is this corner a bit correct? Uh, like, where are you trying to move to? Uh, this corner, right here. That's as close to the corner as you can get. Okay. Without being in the and, wall. Uh, I will. I wanna have her cast. Uh, uh, how is it called? Barrage something. It's a sixty foot cone. So it's uh, like this. I will have cast this conjure barrage. Barrage. Okay. Um. Why that. don't you um? Sing. So, thanks to Tessa, there was another disadvantage. <laughs> oh, no. uh, I would like you to roll me a D four. D four. Yes. Oh, it's my number. Uh, Tessa? Uh, no. Nothing. No, not, not thank you. You said it's 60 feet? A 60 foot cone? You're gonna get some of those guys, but you're also gonna get Hans. Because Ooh. your cone, instead of going in the direction you want, goes directly south. So you're probably going to get these four, but you're also going to get Hans as well. How do I move? So, uh, wait, let me see. These four guys down here? 
Let's get, redraw it in the direction of Hans. Yeah. Like, directly at Hans, or...? He j Hans just has to be in the line of fire. Oh, fuck. Alright, so you will get five. Uh... It is a dexterity save. Yeah, That's 17. Right, right. The damage is 14. If they don't succeed. Or half as much if they succeed. And the damage is the same as the ammunition, and I'm using... Well, actually, I have a spellcasting focus, so I don't know what kind of ammunition that would be. Build deck save. Uh, Pontra Barrage is typically, uh, piercing. Because it's, uh, like an arrow, or... So that's... 14... So I only take half damage because of my evasion. Yes, and it looks like all of them will take full damage. Yes. So even hands. though it even though it misfires, it still hits. Look, Ma, no harms. <laughs> <laughs> I am still up. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> you can hear him audibly groan from all the way across the room. And uh, some of those don't don't look too good. They're not looking too great. Um, Not that tough, are ya? Is there anything else you want to do? So I still have a bonus action, right? Yes. Um, I wanna uh, order the, uh, the steel defender, the bonus action to force empower rent. Uh, how do I select one of those guys? How do I aim right -click. at one of them? You right-click on him. Oh, there you go. I want to attack that guy with the uh, Steel Defender. That's okay, it. do you have your... Uh, do you have the thing you can roll? Yeah. Yeah, that That's 29 one. is going to hit. That would be... Does the Construct get critical? Yes, it does. But that will be this. As an RD8, right? 16 for damage. I know which one. Which one were you attacking? This one. Uh, you see my. This one? Thing? Yeah, the, that one. Alright. How do you do that? Uh, X. There you go. Better. Uh, and this one is. Dead. Everybody did it. Oh, that one. Is gone. Oh. Falls to the ground. Splat. <laughs> Is there anything else? Uh, Is that it? That's it. All right, back to the top. Mr. Rat. Rat man. Which Rat one man. of these, these two of the two armor hulks that I hit? Is the one closest to us or the one further away? The one closest. The one closest to. To me? The yeah, one closest yeah, to you was the, the one, one in... The one in front of us was the chair. Cool, I'm gonna shoot it twice again. Sure. <laughs> uh, gun comes out, musket. Uh, 29. Hits. And a 21. Both hit. Beautiful. Uh, ooh, uh, so that is 30 damage. Wow. Nice. 
Uh, he is not... He's looking pretty bloody. It, like, almost like part of his exoskeleton is starting to crack. Can I do anything else? Wait, he, he... Wait, I know what I'm doing. Um, fuck it. I'm gonna run up. I'm gonna run up. I'm gonna run up on this bitch. I'm gonna bite him with my bonus action. <laughs> Get him. Um, you can play at this game. It's not. It's not a great fucking. Um, oh, there we go. Twenty-one. I, I it hits. Feels Your little rat teeth are able to get like right That's into it. That's one damage. <laughs> He's still up, but you're able I... to get a good hold of him. Here's the thing. I gained four temporary hit points from this using Hungry Jaws. Hey, <laughs> you know? I eat some of the big rat, the big thing. I was like, take a bite out of it. I'm just like, yeah! <laughs> so I'm slightly Man. more healthy now. Yeah, he's a fucking weird little rat dude. Uh, that is my, that is everything I can do in this moment. I'm off back in the way. All right. Uh, next, we've got two gazers up. I think they're gonna. Yeah, you know what? They're both gonna uh, go after the arrow spitter. Um, that is a dex, a wisdom saving throw from uh, Jay, and a dexterity saving throw as well. Uh, the first one is to be charmed, so you have advantage. <laughs> Thank you, James. James, what do you do? What did you do? He knows what he did. He knows what he did. Oh, he definitely knows what he did. <laughs> I'm angry. Rat boy is angry. <laughs> Neof, I need I need a wisdom save with advantage and a dexterity oh. save. Red, what are you doing? Uh, no. I'm helping Hans. <laughs> fudge. The fudge. You. What? You rolled three dexterity saves. No, that's not right. Uh, so it's one wisdom. Oh. Uh, Hans, keep in mind you have advantage. You can use it however you would like. That's wisdom. So I'm going to let you keep the 18 for the dex. Okay. I have no idea what. <laughs> you're you're yeah. fine on that one. It's okay. You're gonna get hit again. We're gonna see with which eyes. Uh, another wisdom, two a uh, wisdom and another dex. Here comes wisdom. Here. It's to be feared, so you don't have advantage on this one. Oh, to, uh, for for oh, okay. So, did it roll? It did not. Uh, James, roll, if you're still so watching, you can you can message me what you want their disadvantage to be. Why? Okay, so why? <laughs> you evil. Why not? <laughs> Yeah. Okay, so Hans wisdom gets and a hero point. Alright, uh, dexterity. Wisdom and dexterity. Wisdom, he passed. You failed the dex save, so you are gonna take... Nine cold damage. As your oh. body, your limbs start to freeze up a little bit. Uh, and then it's uh, the oncoming storm. It's your turn. 
Um, okay. You got these umbers hulking. Hmm. Two! You have two umbers <laughs> hulking. Two umbers, two umbers <laughs> hulking. Hey, he's <laughs> And There's an AK under the tree. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, dying. Oh, we're not dying. We're doing pretty well in here. I mean, yeah, we're uh, doing great too. We're easy, doing. But I, we're you just hear pew too, pews. So. It sounds like some kind of sci-fi and screaming in the other room. <laughs> They're fine. Um, did Grimble look like they they got hurt at all? People just want hands to survive. It's not that we I'm don't want you to face it to the wall. <laughs> <laughs> um, I actually... do believe Grimble took quite a bit of damage. I, um, <laughs> I took a lot of damage. <laughs> Grimble did give us good advice, though. I'm tempted to follow it, but then it would lead the poor rat to fight two Umber Hulks. Um, I'm gonna flip a coin first. You flip that coin. Okay. I will not ignore the advice, but I want to do something first. Uh, the oncoming storm is going to take out their uh, Warhammer. Um, it is a nice looking um, copper wrought instrument and uh, keeping on brand, they are going to tumble between the Hulk's legs and come up the other side. Move, please. Why won't you move? Why won't you move? Thank you, Dido. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, will take, I will set up a flank there and I will use Booming Blade um, with the Warhammer. Cast a spell. I I love that these spells sometimes don't do what they're supposed to. Um, <laughs> it's supposed to just be an attack roll, so. Warhammer. Yeah. Attack. Oh. It's a 14 to hit. That would be good. Uh, 14 does not hit. Uh, you're on a oh wait, wait, hold on! I have a, I have advantage. Sorry, hold on. I, I specifically put myself between <laughs> between our uh, with the. Oh yeah. Uh, Good call. So... Is that two hero points? It's even oh. it's even worse. Yeah, thank you, advantage. <laughs> Go. <laughs> okay, so um, the spell effect. Of uh, on a hit, yeah. So that just doesn't work. Great. Okay, so I will uh, finish my movement. Right. Really? Why are you like this? <laughs> there. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I want to be right there, so I'm between between the Umber Hulks. Um, okay. It, it sounds like a bad idea, but I'm well armored. It should be okay. Yeah. One's name is Rock. The other is Hard Place. Exactly. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> It's not All they right. are now. <laughs> Hans, it is your turn. You are charmed and you are frightened. But you have advantages just that you clarify, could use. Just to clarify, which ones am I charmed slash frightened towards? You are charmed until let me find it. Till where are you? Uh which one specifically they're asking? Until this one goes. You are charmed until this one goes. Seven of them have their hooks into you. <laughs> and you are frightened. That one goes nope, where are you? after me. And you are frightened until this one goes, which is after three after, after you. Mm -hmm. yeah. You but you're still charmed until the until right before J JT's turn. Well, Jay uh, managed to re-unalive. Hans isn't quite sure how it works with these weird ghost things, but 
the one of them is now unalive, so he will double check the door to see did that count as a sacrifice? I will give you this for free. No, it did not. Okay. <laughs> Just banging on the door. Let me out. Um, is there? Does there happen to be a window in in this place or no? There are not windows. What we in the Christmas business call a death trap. <laughs> yes, yes, it is a death trap. It is a barn. There are no windows. The old death trap. Um. I will offer you, you can use one of your advantages to get a little bit of hidden information. I will take advantage of that, yes. Um, I'm going to DM you. Okay. I gotta say, thank you uh, for the hero points. I'm much appreciative. My... Hans did not get enough love, even though he is Al. He is Alan Rickman. <laughs> he didn't. He didn't deserve. Hit the ground running. <laughs> was was that a gravity fun, joke? No, it was actually. <laughs> is that a gravity joke? All right. Yeah, if, it was, if it was a gravity joke, he would have hit the ground falling. So you know. <laughs> Roll. Sorry, making a devil's bargain, trying to kill players here. She's like, we got a time limit to reach. People need to die. <laughs> yep. I'll shoot. I'll shoot fucking Grim, whatever the little gnome piece of shit in the back of the head if you need me to. Oh no, Grimble. <laughs> I, will, I will ice I'm already, that man. I'm already uh, hatching something, as it were. I will. I will fully just fucking. I'll take some people out of this combat, is what I'm saying. <laughs> I am I am ready, willing, to what I came here to do. I hit behind a sturdy oak desk. <laughs> I can get you. I, I can fly. I can get you. Oh, no. <laughs> Flying rats? They fly he has now? Wing boots. I do, too. High five. <laughs> yeah! yeah. <laughs> Let's fly away from these problems together. Yeah. <laughs> Well, Hans no place is... like home. Okay, I know what I want to do. Hans is going to go back up and is going to reopen this door just lightly. And he is going to look at uh, one of the creatures that has yet to attack him. Like, probably this lower one here, maybe. Mm -hmm. And he is going to level his best glare. And he is going to pull out the revolver that he was very happy to find in his pocket. Is that a gun in his pocket? Yes, it is. And uh, Oh, you're not happy to see me? Oh, he is very happy to see the gun, I tell you. And he is going to... Uh, draw back the firing pin and he is going to intimidate it to go go take out one of those others like that rat <laughs> Thank you. Roll. So, no you can keep going so can I roll an intimidation for it to do absolutely that? Absolutely, Apparently, you can. Has a deep seated hatred of rats. Would a 26 be sufficient? Uh, yes. This. Nip, uh, your mic is hot. Nip. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah, this gazer is uh, under your control. So yeah, Hans had opened the had opened this door and is telling that gazer to go dispose of a rat. <laughs> you know how Mrs. Claus feels about rats. 
And, uh... I'm gonna pick not unconscious. unconscious. Gonna throw him off the... <laughs> I'm mad now. Just so I know which one it is. There we go. And this, I'm gonna kill your character in Tuesday. Yeah, yeah, you're you're not that nice. Uh, all right. Um. Uh, hang on one second. There... I just have to do a quick measurement. No, I was gonna offer to help uh, Jay, but uh, he's too far away. So yeah, that'll be his turn for now. It, and you know what? Uh, Hans just intimidated the crap out of this gazer. Uh, so these next two gazers are gonna go after uh, JT. Oh man. Oh, this does spooks. Uh, I need a strength save. And a wisdom save, my friend. Yep. Yep. Can you hear? Hello. Yeah. <laughs> I need a strength save and a wisdom save. Frightened. Strength. Your feet stay on the ground. And you are not afraid. <laughs> But, uh, we're gonna come at you again. <laughs> oh, jeez. Same thing. But the first one is to, uh, the wisdom save is to be charmed. Yes. You're fine. Uh, deck... Strength save. Strength. You're fine. Feet stay on the ground. Let me come back over here to our umbers, um, which is going to move in. It's gonna. It's gonna also get a flank to to attack the oncoming storm. You're gonna. You're gonna get two claws and a bite. That should have been rolled normal, but it doesn't matter. A 26 to hit. <laughs> yeah. A 25 to hit. Mm-hmm. Just misses. Just misses. <laughs> <laughs> Just misses. Not even close. Keep going. <laughs> Oof. 12. That's like Six. I can't even shield that high. <laughs> 18. 18 damage. And then it's gonna bite you for its third attack. Stone it. Uh, eighteen. Eighteen will hit. I'll, I won't waste a spell slot for one. All right. Mm -hmm. mm. Seventeen. <laughs> that hurts so much. <laughs> Seventeen. Oh God, my poor wizard HP. Um. 35, 35. Okay. <laughs> oh god, it hurts so bad. When you're that a wizard, is... it's like <laughs> I, 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 I have two cleric levels and the rest. Are... Oh, okay. So you're a little beefier then. <laughs> I, I'm only slightly beefier. I have, I have 49 HP. I had 49 HP. <laughs> uh, two, two wisdom saves there, uh, JT. The second one with advantage. Yes, you. And a regular wisdom. All right. Alright, you are frightened. Still. 
my guy. You are still frightened. Uh, this one, this one that is under under the control of this this here guy, was told to go find a rat. So it's just gonna zoom zoom, hover hover. into here. That's going to be his turn. <laughs> what in a snickerdoodle? Oh. <laughs> uh, and then it is going to be the Hulk's turn. Hmm. Oh, two delicious incredible. Two delicious snacks. Um, it's gonna go after. Just have one. <laughs> it's gonna go after the one that it has advantage on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Oh, there's oh, wow. oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Wait, we're Good night, one, everybody. Right? <laughs> yeah, D exactly. Um, uh, that's 13. Uh huh. I'm still, still standing. One HP. Let's go. This is looking 20, good. Twenty-four to hit. Uh, wait, hold on. Twenty-four. Shield will not save me. All right. Good night, everybody. <laughs> hey, outgoing storm. I know. I don't think it can the kill you outright. Storm. Oh. All right. No, I don't think it can. But uh, I mean, we got a rat who's coming up next. Mm -hmm. We we lost the, the only one with cleric levels. <laughs> the oncoming storm is gonna is gonna look to rat and just make the best Rorschach voice and just do it. <laughs> uh, and then it's gonna use its third to bite the rat. I'm not gonna waste ammo if you shoot it. It's already dead. No, I'm not dead. I'm dying. Uh, a twenty. <laughs> and uh, by hits. suffering. To the bedroom, but I feel like there's probably uh, a vampire four, or something in there. 16 <laughs> damage. Zombie Mrs. Claus is waiting in there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and that is the Umber Hulk's turn. The Gazer. Um, Hans is no longer frightened or charmed. Uh, but it is it is going after uh, JT again. Uh, I need a wisdom save with advantage and a dexterity save. <laughs> you are, and a dexterity save. You are charmed. Oh, and you make it. So you're good, Grimble. Joy. <laughs> There's an unconscious wizard and two big hulks and something else. Good I don't think Lord, you can see it through the tree. I, I think my head up just, <laughs> just to get a glimpse. I think one is obviously more wounded than the other, right? It's crack more, it's oozing more. Uh, Grimble is going to go for that one, so he is going to try... He doesn't want to get too close, so he's going to try Frostbite again. Yeah, the the one uh, mushed between the two, while the unconscious... The one right next to Harold is probably the worst-looking one. Yeah, that's the one. Constitution save, right? Yes, I do believe. DC 16, con, yep. Uh, seven. All right. Uh, damage. Normal. Eight. <laughs> right. Eight damage. Well, this guy's. Oh, that he's... got inside. <laughs> uh, so the parts that looked like they were falling off, um, freeze and crack, and he drops to a knee. Still up. He doesn't look I, good. I tuck back to behind the desk. 
<laughs> uh, actually, there are gifts under that tree, huh? There are gifts under Good. that tree. So I think with my bonus action, I could kind of reach out and grab one and then duck behind the desk again. Or not my bonus Absolutely. action, but my interaction. You can use right, your... So I'd, let you, I'd let you use your bonus action to open it. Yeah, I'll do that. <laughs> See if there's anything useful in there. Probably just a gift card. <clears throat> uh, roll me a d8. Did she not tell you that all the presents were mimics? <laughs> I'm about to oh, find no. out. Three. Right. Uh, you find an elixir of health. Oh, sweet. Okay. Uh, that's my object interaction, though, so I'm going to sit tight. Yep. JT, you're going to have to make some saving throws again. Let's see which ones. Oh! Uh, Dex, oh. And, Dex and strength. Dexterity, ego, and strength. I'm getting thrown again. You're going to get thrown again. Where's Christmas <laughs> right, in, right into this, this table. All right, and it's your turn. Ooh. Oh, it's my turn now. Okay, <laughs> uh, while charmed, I cannot attack or harm the charmer, right? Let me see exactly what their charm effect does um your speed is halved and any attack rolls have disadvantage attack roll okay and i does using pyrotechnics count as attacking like if i'm using the smoke one do do you have to make an attack roll for it no it's just a constitution saving throw then no it does not count I'm gonna cast pyrotechnics and do a, a 20 foot radius here. Uh, either it's gonna do a smoke, a thick black smoke that spreads out from the target in a 20 foot radius, moving around corners. The aerial smoke is heavily obscured. The smoke proceeds for one minute or until a strong wind disperses it. And as a oh, so it's hard for them to see. Yeah. And, uh, but it is also hard a... for you to see them. Yeah. And as a bonus action, I'm gonna uh, Brandon Smite. So the next attack roll I ever do is going to have an extra 12 radiant damage. Beautiful. And that will be uh, the turn for now. Harold! Is it my turn? Yeah, you have an unconscious friend. And I you mean... have two big hulksters. Uh, friend is subjective. Friend is subjective. <laughs> I have the gutter feet, meaning that any creature within five feet of me, if I attack creatures within five feet of me, I don't get disadvantage. So I'm going to shoot this thing with my gun. Shoot it. Shoot her. Oh, it's 19. Barely hits. Beautiful. Uh, I want to do damage to see if I kill this thing. That's 14 damage. Is it dead? It is dead. It drops. Beautiful. With a thud. I click my heels together, I fly 10 feet in the air, and I shoot this one. Shoot the other one. <laughs> Go! Up to the 20. Yeah, 20 hit. Beautiful. 12 damage. Uh, then bonus action action surge and I'm gonna shoot it twice, more. All right. I'm action it's surging and shooting again. Um, roll me a d100 before oh. you do that. Okay. What did I do to you? 
a lot of things. It's fine. You're going to explode. Don't worry about it. (laughs) Uh, You fly up and you go to fire and uh, and your gun doesn't go off. What? Almost like there's blanks. He got tinsel stuck. Thank you, James. 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 Fine. I action surge pull out my other gun. And I'm gonna you already action the... surged. Oh, I already action. Oh wait, so my my action surge is, is wasted. You used your action surge, but the gun you shot, which took your action, did not fire. It misfired. Right. So can I use my other gun to shoot? I have two. Yes. Beautiful. Because isn't it a bonus action to draw your gun? Uh... No, it was a bonus action to use action. No, it's not. It's a, it's a bonus Once. action to use action surge. Give me a second. Um, there it yeah, is. I think you just have a reaction left. And when you do seven level, you add a proficiency bonus to your initiative. You can stow and draw another firearm with a single object interaction. Okay. Then yes, Gunslinger. you can. Gunslinger. <laughs> There's a class for that. Oh no! Oh. <laughs> No. Oh, come on. No. The DM gets. No. <laughs> so that is my gun misfires and it's jammed. No. So. Oh no, we it's jammed. So well. We were doing so this well is in the strawberry this. flavored. Only one person would have the audacity well. to jam our guns. <laughs> okay. Uh, fuck it. I'll, I'll use my second attack action to try to clear my gun. Okay. Uh, which give me. A, which is a Tinker Souls touch check. I forget the rules on this. <laughs> um, It'll work as a club, right? I mean, I could. <laughs> Improvised weapon? Uh, well, I'll, I'll just roll t- I'll just roll Tinker Souls. That's not, that's nowhere near high enough. So, gun is still jammed. That's my turn. Right. This gazer is gonna move out of the smoke. No, no, no. A dexterity and a strength save, Neop. Hans, you killed us all. <laughs> you fool. <laughs> <laughs> no. Is it first one? All right. You, took... you guys did have to follow him. <laughs> so the first one is a fail. So you are going to take cold damage. You're going to take three cold damage. Okay, there we go. Three cold damage. Uh, and you stay put. Um, this one's gonna move. No. No. Oh, out of the smoke. Inside. <laughs> no, you will die. <sighs> uh, wisdom save. And two wisdom saves. Um, One with advantage. This is Uh, not the typical North Pole um, (laughs) fatality. I just want to throw that out there. (laughs) Oh, no! As as a North Pole representative. (laughs) This is it. You are still charmed and frightened. (laughs) So you really... So... uh, JT, you really can't move um because you can you can i mean yeah because you're frightened by this guy you can move back towards a hans if you'd like uh when it's your turn uh but it's uh i need a death save first death save 
Unfortunately, yes. that elixir of life does not actually give you health. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. What happened? Whose death save? Um, Yours. Mine. Okay. Initiative trackers and shilling. Okay. One sec. Saves. Huh. Why is death not on the saves? Okay. I think it's under utility, I believe. Under utility? Maybe. Nope. Nope. Uh, let me check the character sheet. Uh, there's death saves under attributes to the just to the um, right of dexterity and arcana on the at, on the um, skill list. I see it. Thank you. Yep. Here we go. Uh, you need not roll death saves. Wait, what? Oh, wait. Hold on. Is it not counting? Okay, let me put this at zero. There we go. <laughs> I'm tracking my health on D and D Beyond, not. Oh, <laughs> they're yelling at me like you can't roll death saves. You're not dying. Right. You've got ah, tons of health. Four. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're so Hello. alive. How can you? How can you die? You're so alive, according to our tracker. One fail. Right, Hans. You're up. None of these gazers went after you. Not a single one. Well, guess what? I'm gonna be. You know, not so politely asking this other gazer that came out that's closer to Hans, you know, pointing my re revolver at him and go, Why don't you go hunt a rat as well? Roll me an intimidation check. I didn't even it's really commit Hans. hate crimes I on Rat <laughs> You, the first thing you did when Han saw you is you got up and had a knife to someone. That is the most violent thing you can do. Yeah, he was scared. I, uh, I feel like I, I feel like I this is a pot calling the kettle black. Yeah, you're. Fucking I Hans want to Ruger. remind you guys <laughs> that this is Ren's advantage. Yep, I did this. <laughs> All right. I'm this aware, I'm also... and I'm mad at everyone involved. <laughs> Rin, I'll play I, a lovely this... game with you tomorrow. <laughs> oh, that's right. Oh, you oh, are in that tomorrow. Yeah. 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 All right. This one is also down, no regrets. When it is when it is their turn again, we'll be going after a rat. So in the meantime, Hans will just uh, move. A little closer to uh, JT and you know try not to go into the smoke and just kind of level a stink eye to the one that's to the north hey, well you already used your action so you're just gonna glower at it for now yeah, just a glower of promise Oh, and I will then uh, offer the bonus action, Mastermind, uh, offer the help action for JT if uh, he needs it. Awesome. See, Hans isn't a bad guy. They're helping. Not me. Watch your back. Excuse <laughs> <laughs> Hans, but he woke up after falling from a building, and the first negative thing he sees is a rat trying to knife someone. I can't watch <laughs> anything. I'm dying. Uh, wisdom saving throw and a strength saving throw, please. Hans? Not Hans. Um, JT? Again. Strength and dexterity. Wisdom. Wisdom. Regular. Wish. Regular. Touch. That's okay, because you're going to get thrown into a stall door. Ow. Into your own smoke. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> In the midst of all of them. <laughs> well, I cannot see them. Cannot see me, I think. <laughs> oh, no. oh, they can see you. <laughs> no! Or can they? they? Smell your fear. You can smell your fear. <laughs> they have singular. This purpose. one is going to move out of the smoke. Oh, you think this smoke I can't your see eye. anything. <laughs> well, they see some. 
they they do see Hans, but they're afraid of it. Uh, so there's there's a Hulk. Um, we have a Hulk. We have a Hulk. <laughs> well, and, it mean, is gonna, have... and it's gonna yeah. umber. It's gonna umber over. And it's just gonna punch this thing out of out of the sky. What is what is this thing? Flying this rat. Uh, fourteen. No. Some people would call that a pigeon. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and the 12 won't. So it's gonna try and bite you because what? it's can't punch you. 14? No? no? Okay. Whiff. Whiff. Now Dido rolls bad on attacking people. <laughs> Gazer is also just gonna move out and not see anything. To be fair, the For other the room moment. has been sucking up most of her rolls. That's <laughs> true. That is true. Now uh, that this not. one. <laughs> hey, guess who? Somebody different gets to make a saving throw. Is it me? Yay. It's the rat. I need, I need a strength save. I'm not good at those. <laughs> and I need a wisdom save. I'm. Uh... Uh, on those. 15 on the strength. <laughs> All right, you're fine. And a, I don't know, a 22 on the wisdom. You're fine. That okay. one is dead. So they want to give me a wisdom, a hero point, so I can I can re get revenge on Hans. I wasted mine on Hans. Sorry. You're also <laughs> cool, Nissa. I like you too. Uh, hold on. This so might have enough. It's gonna move out. Uh. And over. As long as you don't shoot me in the head. <laughs> uh, Grimble, it's your turn. Uh, Grimble is going to break cover. He's going to pull uh, something out of his pack that looks like a long candy cane, but he unsheaths it and actually, it's actually a sword. Uh, and he's going to sneak attack that Umber Hog. Um, which I is what is that under features or no you keep skeptical around it uh you should be able to roll it with your attack not seeing that on the am i missing it on the character sheet somewhere resource one resource two Features, not features. There's sneak attack. Did that do anything? Are you? What are you? What are you using? Your short sword? Yeah. So just roll a. Uh, there we go. With the sneak attack, so. So you would have advantage, and I think when you do damage, you'll be able to click sneak attack, or you'll get. You can add in whatever the d6 is. Oh, so, click the short sword, right? Something's not working right. Is that do is that even doing anything? <laughs> uh, yeah, so what it'll do is it'll bring up something in the chat and you click uh the attack button uh in the chat box of Foundry. Yeah, okay, I did. It doesn't seem to want to. You have to click on the little be... thumbnail itself, not just the word. Oh, just the thumbnail. Well I see short sword in there. And the attack it, button, but the attack button's not active. Uh, okay, so you attack with advantage here. I'll do it. <laughs> I'll take hey, it. Yeah, we'll take that. <laughs> Thanks, Dino. <Yeah. laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Merry Christmas to me. Um, yeah, so then it is um, short sword damage. How, is... how many d6 do you have for your sneak attack right now? You know what? It doesn't. It doesn't matter. I'll just do this. One special five feet. Jesus. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't see that coming, did? You? 
then if I have enough movement left, I'm going back behind the desk. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He is looking. He is. He is still up, but he is looking hurt. This thing off, rat man. <laughs> right. This geezer is gonna go straight out and move just past Hans. Oh, I fucking say, just stay where you're at. They're all vacating the area. <laughs> uh, JT, you're up. You are in your own smoke. Uh, and afraid. Sure. Okay. Uh, do I do do I? Can I see these guys in front of me? You cannot. Um, I don't think anybody can see anybody inside of it. And okay, what can I? You could do? still you could still attack them with advan with disadvantage, but you have disadvantage anyways, so it doesn't matter. Do um if. Okay, um, Yugi is going to try to feel the wall to her. If you feel, you feel Staldor. Yeah, if I know Staldor is here, I know that supposedly before I got inside here, there should be bad guys uh, perpendicular to it, parallel, right next to it. So he's going to uh, shoot a caustic brew. Uh, mm -hmm. Tasha's caustic. She's gonna cast Tasha's caustic brew. All right, in that's a... this direction. That's only that's a that's five feet, right? It's a thirty foot line, but it's only like a five. It's five feet wide, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's the word I meant. Uh, dex dexterity. It's okay. There's you're only gonna get you're only gonna get two. Uh, one of them passes and one of them fails. Is it half damage? Uh, let me see. Um, a stream of acid emanates from you in a night 30 feet long and 5 feet wide in a direction you choose. Each creature in the line must succeed uh, 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 or be covered in acid for the spell duration or until the creature uses its actions. It takes... 2d4 acid damage at the start of each of its turns. I, I, don't, I, I don't know. Okay, so the only one who gets sprayed with acid is the one in the back. Okay. Did I... Uh, that's the best. I didn't exactly understand what went on. Okay, yeah, so the one Whoops. the one in the back will take the acid damage. When it, it's When it is its turn. Which is one? one? I'm gonna, I'm gonna... As soon as I find the poison... Yeah. These... Icons six are very acid small. Damage. Six, six, there you go. six acid damage. In the first turn. I think that's yep, so on its turn, it'll take uh, damage before it can do anything. Okay. Is there anything else you would like to do? Uh... I still have a, I still have a bonus action. He, uh, Huge, Huge uh, is gonna call, is gonna call upon her uh, steel defender to attack whatever uh, is nearby it. He doesn't know where it is actually, since it's probably somewhere. I lost track of where it could be. Steel defender. Um, I think it might still be in the upper corner with the presence. No, the steel defender was down here. Was like, nope. Use the right button. Was like down in here to attack yeah, one of these. Yeah, uh, So it's supposedly you... somewhere around here. Yeah, do you want it to so... attack this one? Yeah. Because it would be nearest... closest to it. Yeah, the nearest one it can yeah. attack. A 25 to hit. That is gonna hit, and that little flying boy is also dead. Eight. It had there you go. two HP. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh. So you probably didn't even have to roll for damage. Oops. All right. Is there anything else? Was that everything? And that's everything, I think. 
Where's this going? Uh, Harold! Harold the Rat! Hello! Um, alright, I'm gonna use my first uh, attack. I'm gonna use my uh, first attack to try to clear my gun. Um, my, uh, simply, specifically my, uh, musket. Okay. I had a plus four to this. Oh, come. Wow. Is the Umber Hulk You do dead? have a hero point. I do have a hero point. Can I use the hero point to clear my all my this clear my gun? I'm gonna tell you that the one that fired blanks the first time is not jammed. It wasn't jammed? It, no. Oh, but the one I you rolled was... the natural one on is jammed. Well then never mind. I will not I I don't do that and I just fucking reload my gun. Um because <laughs> I ignore loading properties. So cool. Is the Umber Hulk in front of me dead? Both of them? Nope. Wait, I yes. Will... Yes. Both... Cool. Um, Hold on. No, one of them is alive. Yes, I, th I didn't think I quite dropped it. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna move the one that. Uh... Second question is: the Oncoming storm still dead? Dying. Failed. Failed one death. Right. Yeah, still unconscious. Okay. Right, I'm, I'm just, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm gonna say my hero point. I'm gonna shoot this, this, this thing with my gun. Shoot him. Uh, I have to find my... There it is. First attack. Uh, 17, which I think misses. It does miss. Second attack. Misses. I'm just mad now. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna move around the... Um, I'm gonna fly over down the hall. Should I potentially use my hero point to revive the oncoming storm? Sure. Yeah. Can I just run over and like fucking pulp fiction, like get a weird like rat technology thing of adrenaline, just stab it into her heart <laughs> and uh, bring her back? Yeah. Uh, oncoming storm. You get I'm not dead. You get jabbed with. Uh... Is some I... needle thing that this rat person just... just happens to have? Uh, no way you're that's alive. not covered in tetanus. Yeah, there's just... I, I gotta get checked out later. This is not okay. Um, you're not dead. <laughs> how many... Uh, yeah. What's your max hit points? <laughs> not much. Uh, 49. Uh, you get 20 hit points back. All right. Ooh. I'm back, help baby. Kill, help me kill Hans. You don't know that I said those things. Do I not know that? Do I just know these things? You do not. Mind? You do not know that. Help us, please. <laughs> we'll put it please. together. Check, cause they. Open. <laughs> hey, you <have> magic. <laughs> Roll a figure hmm. out check. <laughs> that is your turn, and now it's Gazer. Which which one is it? This one way up here is gonna just can't really see anybody, but things that it thinks is uh, its friend. So it's gonna stay there. It's not gonna do anything. Oh, oncoming storm! Oh, I'm alive. Uh, half my movement to stand up. Oh, gosh, be a returning okay. storm. Yeah. <laughs> the returning star. Yes. Back with a vengeance, baby. All right. This is going to. Uh, okay. Oh, I had a thing, but I don't want to hurt Felix now that they saved me. <laughs> I can't hurt you. You help me. You're a healer. He knows what the fuck <laughs> is up. <laughs> I, I, it's I, sort I, of teamwork in this room. It's, it's. Uh, Darwinism in the other room. <laughs> yeah, I definitely, I definitely told you I was a healer. That is true. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. So, um, okay, I think I can pull this off without hurting Felis. Let me just check real quick. I was 
not ready for it to be no my turn. No friendly fire. After. Hey, nobody said that. <laughs> I just don't want to. Uh, I'm going to check D&D Beyond because it's not giving me what I need on there. Um, e word yet. Word, word. Yeah, exactly. Um, so it's going to be... Oh, okay. Ten foot radius. Cool. I can do this without hurting feelings. Okay. Oop, oop. Uh, um, Oncoming Storm gets back onto their feet and uh, they are just going to sit uh, at the at the hearing help. Um, they're they're just going to say, "You want me to put the hammer down? Fine." And I'm going to channel uh, Wither and Bloom through their hammer, and they are just going to bring the hammer down on this Umber Hulk, um, and they will channel Divinity to max its damage. And now I'm going to cast it yes. because I need I need help, <laughs> and I'm going to make sure that. I'm gonna make sure that I'm in the radius. There we go. Uh, Eleven. Ah, oh, thank goodness. <laughs> uh, okay, so it is being cast. Ah, oh, fuck! I probably will not get another chance to do anything. It's being cast at fourth level. So third level or higher, it increases by a d6. 2d6 becomes 4d6, so 4 times 6 is 24. What? Math. Because I'm channeling Divinity, it's maxed out. Okay. What level are you casting it at? Fourth level. So it's two extra. It's 2d6 to the start, right? That's what I'm seeing. So 24? Yes. That was that was my bathing. It was 24. Yeah. Um, in addition, one creature of my choice, which is me, can s can spin and roll one of the Oh, I thought it was trade for heals. All right, well, I'm going to spend hit dice. One of the spend spend three hit dice. dice. Yeah, three hit dice. I'm going to get some more health back. Are you, is there going to be anything else your turn? That will be it. I will roll these hit dice. I'm going to roll my two of my cleric levels and then one of my wizard um you guys see that uh uh and that's all thunder damage by the way okay the fire from the uh fireplace in the kitchen starts to spill over and out getting closer to you guys in the doorway what the shit is this house? Uh oh. And while you're doing that, while you're rolling your health, Hans. Jesus Christ, come on. <laughs> come on, roll a six. You, nope. you, <laughs> you essentially have all of these little gazers at your beck and call. I think you're muted. I forgot I was using buttons. I'm so used to the talk reaction. But anyways, so these little guys are at my command, as it were. <laughs> he is going to look to these three. Um, this one, this one, and this one. <laughs> and he is going to tell them because, uh, unfortunately, this guy has fallen. Mm -hmm. He is going to tell them, go help your friend find a rat. Do I need to roll intimidation for that? No. You're, you're, you're being quite, quite intimidating already. Yeah, you're the oh, alpha yeah. of the pack now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what conditions I'm giving these guys, but I'm giving them conditions just so I remember that. And then Hans will move He moves up right over here and he will kind of look towards this cloud and he will call into there um uh, 
I don't think he's actually addressed them by name yet, but he introduced himself as, uh, Nyap, is it, uh, Yuji? Uh, Huge. Huge. Yes, he will call in. Huge. Come on out. These gazers will help us now. Really? I yes. mean, they were throwing me around like a little toy. Yes, come on out. We will go and check this other room. And he will then ask, he will then kind of motion to these two other engagers to just move aside so that he can check this other door. Well, they're not going to be able to move, and you've already controlled three, yeah. so, so pretty you much can't control like, these two. Yeah. So that's pretty wait. much for whenever they go. But so pretty much, um, I will be holding an action to defend myself with my revolver that's out if one of them decides to change their mind and attack me. Oh, oh by the way, uh, I had cast... Uh, what do you call that? Uh, I had cast... Uh, uh, Branding Smite, but I suppose that dropped because I cast Tasha's Caustic Brew, right? Because both are concentration. Yeah, if it's another yeah. concentration, you want to drop it. Okay. Alright, now it's this Umber Hulk's turn. Um, not a fan of the fire. It's gonna go after the one that just came back up. Two, two claws. Nope. Uh, Eleven. Nada. Twenty-four. Uh, I can't shield that. Awesome. Okay. Yeah, for six damage. damage. And then a bite for their last one. Eighteen. You know, I made the mistake of not shielding it last time. I'm going to shield it now. All right. So not going to hit. Then it's going to start moving away from the fire. It's not stupid. So you both get the tax of opportunity. Right, if you want to take it. Come on. Oh, that figures. Okay. <laughs> That's very you, beautiful. Do you, have, do you you don't you have a gun out? Are you using a one-handed or two-hander? He has two guns out. You're muted. Hello. 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 Sorry about Hello. that. I thought I was muted. I have two guns. Oh, I, I've I've stowed one gun. I have my musket out. It's a two-hander. Um, can I have hit them with the gun? It would be an improvised weapon, so I it would be what a D four. It would be D four. That's two D four damage. I'll do it. <laughs> it's still damage, yeah. Yeah, I'll do it. The Ember Hulk is, is down. It had one HP left. Yeah. yeah! Let's look at her trying to gaslight you out of that damage. <laughs> <laughs> Two guns, I will, one for I each will do any bit of damage I can. I just swing my, this fucking crack it in the head with the butt of my rifle. And it drops. I'll move him back here, because he drops. Now we kill Wait. the eye thing. This one is going to move out of the way. This one is gonna do what it was told and try and find a rat. It doesn't know where there's a rat at, but it's gonna follow its friend. All right, uh, Grimble. Uh, I'm gonna use May's hand to shut that door. <clears throat> All right. You would need me to roll. The door is thing. shut. All right. <laughs> 
Do you have any bonus actions you want to do? Uh, I will see if I can search another one of those presents. Sure. Well, I mean, Roll me a D8, D8. right? Merry Christmas to me, number th another three. <laughs> it is another elixir of health. <laughs> I must have bought these things in bulk. <laughs> yeah, you right, stashed it away. <laughs> uh, not as JT, as it sound. your friend told you it was safe. <laughs> it's my turn now? Yep. Uh, One Jake? of these gazers should have taken damage. JT is going to come out uh, so it's dead. right here, where she heard the voice from Hans. And she's going to come out uh, and hold an action of using her crossbow in. Uh, ready an action of using her crossbow to attack. If anything attacks her. Great. Uh, if I ready an action to attack, in this case, does the extra attack uh, count, or does that not? You do not over? get the extra attack because it's a reaction, okay. so you only get one. So only one attack. Okay. Is that is that your turn? Uh, no, I still have a bonus action. I was thinking what doing, what to do with it, and uh, she's just gonna order the. The steel defender to come to come to next to her. What is the movement? Thirty. Uh, the steel defender has a movement of forty. Forty speed. Yeah, forty. So it can okay. move right next to her. Yeah. Yep. Here we go, and that will be it. Um, this gazer can't find a rat. The door is closed. But it's it's over there waiting. Uh, Harold. Harold's map. Um, he's gonna run up here and he's gonna shoot these two in here, or try to at least. Did. Cool. I'm gonna use a sharpshooter. Uh, take a minus five, but a plus ten to damage against the absolutely. First. Just against the first one. I want to see how it works for me. Not great. Ten. Uh, it still hits. Oh, it's a ten. It's a ten. Oh, it didn't take the minus five. That does not hit. No, I, I, I just, I'm doing it. I just, I just, the second one, I won't do sharpshooter. Also, I should attack the same guy. So excited. I should have. Maybe that. Well, Nin 19 will hit. That's fine. Whatever. Seven damage. Four, seven damage. Uh, Nissa, you feel this sharp pain in your skull what? Um, as you take three psychic damage. What? I'm so happy psychic? now. Psychic damage. I think I have as you that. Hang on. Where did that come from? Oh, it came from a psychic to... link with a bunch of little groupers. Yeah, I have <laughs> resistance to psychic damage because I'm a Gensiaki. So you take one psychic damage. Oh no, I felt a headache. <laughs> a minor inconvenience. <laughs> Uh, but that is, uh, I think that's everything I want to do. Um, yeah, so that's everything I want to do for right now. Uh, that's the end of Harold's turn. All right. Um, this gazer, yeah, I need saving throws. Oh, yet again. I need two dex. I need two dexterity. I need a dexterity saving throw, and a strength saving throw. Okay, that's good. That's not good. Uh, 
Does the, does uh, the, is there time to react for the shoot? You're able to get your shot off before you get thrown across the room. So I do the same attack. A 19. Uh, 19 will hit. What are you attacking? Uh, whatever attacked me. The one that's if attacking you? Know. This one? This yeah. one right here? Okay. Yeah. We got so roll damages. Right. Uh, I need I need Hans and uh, JT to roll me dexterity saving throws. As this thing oh. explodes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, oh. invasion. That's, That's a crit. great moment to get that. Uh, you can use your evasion, but you still have to roll a dexterity saving throw. Yeah, I just love saying it ahead of time. That twenty-one. Yeah. Yep. You both save, so this will be half damage. Or nothing for me. Half of a whole bunch of tens. <laughs> Uh, so that's 12 fire damage as this thing explodes and catches all of these presents behind you on fire. Oh no. That's Which okay. will spread on initiative count 20. They're all full of volatile organic compounds too. It's <laughs> super bad for your health. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I have a flash of genius. Toys it's are super <laughs> flammable. Uh, oh yeah. 70 toys. You, you got thrown <laughs> right into the pre right into the fire. Yeah. No! <laughs> oh no! Uh, oncoming storm! My children the fire is spreading. Amazing. Why is everything on fire? What is happening? is built right on top of hell. <clears throat> what are you going to do? Sorry, was that for me again? Yeah, you have like a little sliver before you're, lit on, you're caught on fire. Me? As the fire is spreading. Yes, you. The fire from the fireplace over here? Oh, I'm not. Has spread. I'm not... I'm not staying there. That that's silly. Um, I'm gonna do a starlight. I'm gonna do a starlight step and get the hell out of there. Come fly with me. <laughs> no, I'm gonna I'm gonna teleport. Oh, pretty, pretty, huh? <laughs> okay, it's that's also cool. Um, okay, so is this door open over here? No, it is closed. Closed. Okay, so Thanks so the ga the gazers are just stacking up. Gotcha. Um, yeah. They don't know what yeah, else to do, two, so they're attacking. There are two inside the room, two outside the room. I can't seem to move still. Oh, that's because you're caught in the door. Ah, that... Yeah, I want to be there. Um, so there's just these two visible, right? Yes. Okay. So then I will fire a lightning bolt at one. Which is actually a fire bolt change to lightning. I know that's confusing with the actual light. So, uh, yeah. A 21 will hit it. 21 to hit. Four. Seven lightning. Seven lightning. Uh, am I yes, you are, you are still charmed and frightened. And on fire, and explosion. Yeah, and on fire. <laughs> a lot's happening. Um, speaking of the fire, this fireplace um, also explodes. Oh, come on. <laughs> what the shit? <laughs> uh, this place was built by the lowest possible bidder. <clears throat> but it's going to get one of the... Why you it's, never I need, a, I need a dexterity saving throw from uh, the oncoming storm. Oh, you're killing me here. That's the point. Oh, me. <laughs> uh, fucking A. Both, both <laughs> fail. That one. God bless it. Oh my god. I want to make sure I pull the right die. No, we're not going to roll d20s. <laughs> oh 
Oh my god. 18 fire damage. Uh, this one's hey, you're alive. I'm still alive. <laughs> we have healing potions. That one is dead. I can carry oh, a condition if you want. <laughs> um, no, I, I'm still good because I did that healing. Ugh. Uh, you, you take um, nine, nine psychic damage. And that is already, already with your resistance. Mm -hmm. All right. And it's your turn. Clutches his head. He clutches his head. Damn it. And uh, he will look at the one gazer that... The two gazers that aren't actively going towards the door and the ones that are actually just still in the room. Is this uh, mist still here or no? Uh, if it's concentration, uh, he needs to make constitution no, saving it's throws. Not, it's not a concentration. The smoke is... Um, it's, it's there for a minute. It's there for a minute or until wind disperses it. Well, I don't oh, yes, think it's has there. enough hot air in him in order to... <laughs> that, so. He will just call out to the room in general and just say, Wait by the door for that rat. And uh, he will encourage... Uh, uh, Yugi to come on, get out of that fire already. And he will probably... Oh yeah, Yugi! That's right! I forgot to do the fire in this room! Uh... You do not get your evasion, because that's a reaction, correct? Is evasion a reaction? Okay. Because this would have happened before your turn. I know Uncanny Dodge is a reaction. Um, I think evasion is just, I have to say it. I, oh wait, but I think it is just once per turn. Okay, so you don't- you won't have your evasion on this one. I need dexterity saving throws from both of you. Uh, disadvantage for my boy that's in the fire currently. <laughs> I think I'm fine. We'll still take half damage. Yep, I need a dexterity saving throw at disadvantage, please. There you go. A disadvantage. Oh, I still lose anyway. All right. Uh, <laughs> Neop, you take 23 fire damage, and Nissa, you 22. take half of that. What? So do you want it to be 11 or 12? Uh, rounded down. It's rounded down, so 11. Okay, so uh, Hans will and just make his way over to the store and first check to see if, if it's even open. It is not open. It is locked. And he will try uh, using his toolkit to open it. Alright, well you used your action to command one of your little gazers. Oh, okay. Um, but when you kneel down to get ready, to look at the lock, you see the same inscription as is on the other door. One must die. He keeps that to himself. Uh, which gazer? There are too many of them. All the gazers. All of the gazers. This can't go anywhere. It's waiting for a rat. This gazer is also waiting for a rat. It's gonna follow its friends. You're dead, you're dead. This gazer was given nothing. Hey, uh, Neop. Yay. A uh, dexterity save and a wisdom save. Charm or normal? Not charm. I notice your roommate hasn't called them off of you. <laughs> <laughs> well, to be fair, there's one that I can't see. The other ones have been called off, but yeah, the, I can't order the one I can't see and can't see oh. these. Uh, you are <laughs> frightened. So you cannot oh, move. You are frightened. 
Am I still charmed? Uh, I would say at this point, no, because I think you've passed all of your charms and they've all went through. There you go. You are only frightened. Okay. And does the I does the frightened condition make it to where you can't move? You can't move towards the object of your fear. Yeah. So you're stuck in the fire. Yeah. Because the object of your fear is standing right in front of you. Yeah. That's rough, buddy. Well, hmm. I cannot you move, move to towards side. it. Yeah, exactly. You, can, still... you cannot move closer to it, and any direction is closer to it because you're in a bay. You're in a bay ah, of fire. Right. I'm so scared you'd rather. Is there uh, fire, fire right here? Yeah. You are in the fire. The presence, the presence are fire. Yeah. That's is there rough, fire? Buddy. And it's all around here. you. The fire oh. is all around you. I cannot move here. Yeah, Mr. Mr. Hans is gonna get lit on fire again next round as it spreads. Uh Grimble, you're up. Well, so <clears throat> the fire that burst out of the fireplace is, was that a one-time thing, or is there like a, a no? It is. It is starting or... to catch. It has started to catch right. on the bookcase and the rug. Okay, um, it's less than ideal. Feeling my movement's only 25 feet. Um, I will dash to the door and see if I can pick the lock, even though I'm fairly certain I know the answer to this already. <laughs> Do you need me to make a check? Roll, yeah, roll me a thieves tools. Great. Where? Um, Would be dexterity plus proficiency. Yeah, it's under features. No. Uh, a dex plus proficiency, so I'll roll dexterity. Uh, it's an ability check. Uh, you can roll sleight of hand. It should theoretically. I, uh, I, I don't know what your stats are like, but. Well, I have proficiency, or I have like extra proficiency in the theme. All right. Um, well, with whatever the proficiency will be, you kind of get the same message that uh, Hans, that uh, Gruber has been seeing. Uh, this inscription appears that uh, says that one must perish. I'm going to relay that to the group. Hey, this door says one has to die. <clears throat> Better to make our missing friends die than us. <laughs> I agree. Yeah, I'm not gonna argue with that. <laughs> uh, Do we? JT, make me make me a dexterity saving throw. Oh. <laughs> if one of you can open against me. If one of you can, <laughs> if one of you can open the door, I can handle the rest. Oh. You're gonna take. Uh, it's disadvantage. Roll again. Oh, this disadvantage. Because you're standing in the fire. Oh my yeah. That's oh, so much damage. Okay, still, okay. You still take half. Uh, half which is 15. 15? 15 fire. 15 fire damage. Oh, mm -hmm. Christ, I'm still dead. And it's your turn? Oh, it's my turn now. Yes, um, it is. So we are going to one... take a break at the end of this round. We're going to take a quick five minute break. So the source of my fear break. is literally the one in front of me. This one right here in front of you. Okay. So I'm going to use the crossbow to attack twice. They pulled miss. 
you have to be fucking kidding me. Um, she's gonna order the 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 the, 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 the big guy as a bonus action to attack it. The, the oh, defender. it's also in the fire. It also needs to make dexterity save throws. Oh right, it's. Because oh, it, it has a health a, pool. Is that dexterity saving throw? Yep, it's gonna need to make what two of them? Ouch. I think that. All right, so it'll take fifteen fire damage. How much was the first one? It was like twenty-three or something like that. Yeah. So fifteen and twenty-three fire damage. That's a total of. I don't math. Thirty something. <laughs> Oh, the 38. Pictures, the other 38. Let's see. Uh, 38. Oof, it's still alive. Well, it still can attack. Yes. Okay. So it's going to move up and attack. That's uh, one of these. I suppose that hits. A 13 will hit. And that's 9 force damage. The gazer is still up. Mother trucker. I still don't, I don't have anything else. I don't have anything else. This but... one is waiting. All right. Uh, we are going to take a quick five minute break uh, because we started two fights at once. Um, so everybody can take a quick bathroom break. And uh, we'll be back and see how this fire and these gazers um, make our friends explode. Hopefully somebody will die. Yeah. Oh, wouldn't you want Hopefully to? not me. <laughs> somebody yeah. has to die. I mean, oh. I somebody Hans has dies. to die. I hope Hans dies before Hans. I mean, there are some more explosions that are that are set to come. So. Stay tuned. For all we know, some of these the presents have like C4 in them. Who knows? <laughs> I, you, you know what? I, I was looking now. for a 9 really, to be honest with you. <laughs> Who knows what these elves like to do in their off time? Oh, shit. The weird owl song comes to mind. Mm -hmm. it's a I am, I am, I am waiting for Hoop to send us to break. Hoop. Hoop. There it is. Hoop is. Use the force, Hoop. No, you won't do Hoop. The night oh, Hoop went crazy. Ooh. PC Death must unlock the door. PC yeah, death no, he says we grind break. until someone dies. <laughs> you guys are stuck oh, until you all die. Yeah, we uh, kill the first maybe, person and it goes more maybe, blood is required. Maybe we're, maybe we're not gonna go to break. Oh, right. <laughs> maybe okay. maybe we'll we've just been, we've been vetoed. Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> right. Everyone Let's hold your pee. <laughs> <laughs> we cannot go to break. Our host is gone. No. I'm re I'm ready to continue. Do this. And we'll, we'll keep we'll keep going until Hoop tells me that uh, he's back, and then yeah. we'll go to break. And then. Uh, so Harold, your turn. Sweet. You are up. Harold is an angry, angry rat. Uh, so move over here and shoot this fucking gazer. Yeah, gonna, shoot it. Out, what am I pulling out my dice? I don't need my dice. I need my fake dice. <laughs> uh, that also not my favorite oh, person. okay, cool. <sighs> um, you rolled me and still hit. <laughs> that, uh, that is 17 damage. Uh, nice. This geezer goes down. Nissa, you take 17 damage. Is that uh, already halved or not yet? It is already halved. As you hear this screaming in your head. I was. Oh, yeah, no, I already know the door. Nope, nope. That gazer was already dead. Yeah. Um, that gazer's dead. I'm just going to delete them. Uh, I'm not 
quite in range to get through there. Um, if you open it up, I can do the rest. I, I can't. I can't get close enough. Um, yeah, I'm yeah. five feet from the door. I can open it with Mage Hand, but that'll be after your turn, so. Yeah. Uh, I can um, hold an action. If you want to do that. That's smart. Yeah, uh, fucking. That is everything I can do in this. In this. For the Actually, for the mage hand, I mean, I can I can hold my action. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually will use my other attack action to clear my to try to fix my pistol right now. Um, because I can do that. Uh, All right. Uh, you're just you're just fixing your pistol, right? Uh, Because yeah, now, the, now yeah, we're I, gonna go to break. Uh, I could do this. Welcome back. Sweet baby rays. Sweet baby rays. Sweet I just I just asked rays. my players what kind of barbecue sauce do you like cuz you're about to get charred. Um get, she actually said she actually said toast. toasty beforehand. So I did I asked, did say toasty. You should you should you should have said butter. Uh, it would have worked better. Oh man, but I didn't. But uh let's finish up this uh this encounter, guys. Uh, the oncoming storm. Yeah. Or the recurring uh, storm. The, re the returning storm at this point. Um, yeah, so uh, it's getting toasty in here. So I'm going to move. And I'm going to preemptively move to be like. Are you flying, Harold? Harold is flying. Okay, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be underneath Harold, and I still can't seem to myself. I don't know what it did. Uh, uh, you might be on the ruler tool, so you want to click I on the am. square. Thank you, Ah, Dido. You're amazing. Oh, I, I try. <laughs> <You're too good. laughs> so I can't I can't be under Harold, but uh, no, I'll be right there, and I'm gonna hold my action to cast a spell for when the door is open. Okay. Uh, and after your after your turn, the fire starts to spread. We will start with this one. Get a bit dicey in here. Burn, mm -hmm. burn. I'm gonna join the lark now. Gotta get that door open, y'all. Somebody has to die. Hans, curse your sudden but inevitable betrayal of the most trusting toy maker. Uh, so Ouch. I need dexterity saving throws. Um, <laughs> from like. all three of you. Everybody Wait, out the, the window. Fire. Well, yeah, the three that are in there. 18. Uh, 22. 11. Plus, plus I have on Candy uh, Dodge. And Evasion. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so... Right yeah, so I think you'll take no damage because you passed. Is that how... I don't... I forget how Evasion works. I, I'm pretty sure that, yeah, if I would take half damage, I'd take none. Okay. <sighs> uh, so... The Oncoming Storm, you take 16 fire damage. Um... Grimble will take none. Down. Uh, down and Harold, yes. Harold G. Rat, you will take <laughs> nine, nine fire damage. Yeah, I'm back down. I only had 10 HP. Well. How's everybody looking? Oh, wait, I want to take eight. Oh, I'm still what good. What am I doing? Oh, Dino, uh, Dino's just hitting me with full damage all game. Apparently, I didn't get the rogue memo. I need, <laughs> Everybody I need, else is a rogue. I, I need uh, Harold to make another uh, dexterity saving throw as the tree behind you explodes. Oh, no. That's an inch of this room that's not on fire. <laughs> that is an explosive. Okay, the... you just you just made you just made the DC. Uh, the so snow spray eight. that they put on the trees. That's They're highly combustible. So oncoming storm, you're you're on fire. That's two failed death saves. 
like mm -hmm. that stuff that looks like fake webs they used to call angel hair. Yeah, that stuff went up like like nothing too. You know, um, oh. two of oh. those you say? Oh wait, hold on. There's more fire in here. I forgot. Oh. <laughs> there's there's more. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Uh, yeah. The other Harold, two was, can't leave we, you we, out. Oh, Dexterity no. saving throws. Harold, we placed it. We we did promise an unaliving pact. If it's really bad. No. <laughs> I, oh, no. I, oh. I meant that oh I would kiss you as uh, we both won, and then we would kill ourselves. I didn't mean this. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh no. Hans, no. Hans, <laughs> yes. I feel like I'm you both started running in the right direction, and then got confused gonna, and ran back in the other direction. Yeah, I'm going to assume um, evasion for Hans. Uh, yes. So you'll take... 11. 12, 11? Yeah, 11. Uh, and J JT, you take 23 fire damage. Yeah, I'm down. As the fire the grows. Club. And, um, Hans, you're up. I told you, people were gonna start dying. Alright, well, Hans is standing in the fire. He doesn't like this. Uh, so, number one, he's gonna use his bonus action to, uh, he feels this surge open up at him to yeet himself away from there, and he's going to move 30 feet back towards this door, away from the pot. If I'd known you were going to play Hans Gruber, I would have made a cowboy. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, and then call yourself John. But I'm anyways... surprised Hans Gruber shaking up the game. But uh, yeah, so then survives, he is going to. to out of the roof and choke him to death. He is <laughs> going to use his action to uh, pull out the healing potion that he's found in his pocket and take that, obviously. Are you using your hero point to do it for a free action? Well, he's going to use his hero point to down the second healing potion he had in his pocket. Okay. Okay. Okay, and one more. Uh, that'll be your turn. The I'm just gonna move all the gazers because they're 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 basically under your control. Yeah, and then he's also just going to finish up his healing and he's going to move up, finish using his actual movement and move over to the door and he's going to tell, well, he can't tell the gazers to do anything, but he'll just kind of acknowledge them and hopefully they're smart enough to stay out of the fire. We'll find out. Uh, Grimble, you're in fire. I do not like that. Um, we are in fire. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I'm just going to beeline for this door, open it, and jump out onto the other side. <laughs> With as much movement as I can muster, which is to about here. Oh, but I've got two. And they can come through like that, right? Collides with yeah, at least I'll... one wall. <laughs> Oh, you get to at least there. No, not there. There. Yeah. Starting to pat myself out. <laughs> Is there <laughs> just kill some of the gazers? Don't forget them. The... Uh. You're not a rat. Yeah, you should be fine. Could. Yeah. Right. They haven't been attacking me. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I could be a complete prick and close the door behind me, though. <laughs> I mean, oh, you could. You could. I just open the door again. <laughs> what kind of door handles does this have? Um. Are they knobs? <laughs> Are they the kind of thing that I can slide my sword through? They're <laughs> they're the kind that you're very, very intimately familiar with. So you get time closed with some tinsel? So I would say with a successful sleight of hand, you could jimmy it shut to where they can't open it. 
if that is what you would like to do. I'm gonna give it a try. I, I I've heard the rat talk about kill. The first time we met. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you did threaten to shoot me in the head like four times since. So. That was out of character. <laughs> oh! oh! You're able to close God. the door, but you're not quite Ooh. able to get the tinsel to, like, jam in the, uh... What are they called? The tumblers. Quite right. But the door's closed. Um, JT, I'm gonna give you one death save. If you can roll a natural 20... Okay, you will be uh, not dying. <laughs> you got this. That's a 13. Now I give him a hero point. Uh, yours. So that that is a that's two failed because you're on fire and you're still in fire. So I'm going to give you one more round to try and get that natural 20. Oh, shit. She's so dead. <laughs> right, the gate. Harold! We died the way we lived, Toasty. Toasty. Door opens. Fucking. Comes out here. Um. Oh. Yeah, you have to actually, like, go through the door. I, I am going through the where door. Do you, where do you want to go? Uh, over here. Oh, over here. Go there. <coughs> Excuse me. That's you. Thank you. Smoke inhalation. Uh, it's a real thing. <laughs> I come out and I'm going to shoot these two fucking gazers. Okay. Uh, See, gazers, the rat is against you. 26. 26 hits. And then second attack is a 21. That hits too. Are you doing one in one? I'm gonna sh I'm gonna focus on one. If it dies, I'll focus on the other. You you already rolled. Are you doing one in one? Or are you shooting them both at the same one? I will shoot one one on one one against one. Okay. Yeah. One. Roll the damage one. for the first one. Seven. Uh. Nissa, you take seven psychic damage. And then the Ow. second attack. Uh, sixteen. Nissa, you take 16 psychic damage. Is that already halved? You did. This cannot be halved because of the connection that you have with the gazer. Okay. And then I am going to do the uh, second win. You already used your second win. No, that's huh? second win. You use your action surge. Yeah, second yeah, win. Action. I heal 13 hit points. Ooh. All right, Ren, natural 20. Let's go. <laughs> uh, Come on, baby. Have, you seen, have you seen my dice? Come on. Uh, <laughs> all right. Oh, condition's dead. The hey, that's fun. <laughs> <laughs> it's a condition. Uh, yeah, it's a serious condition. It is. Uh, all right. Death saves, death saves. Which one are you? Are. Yeah. Good night. That's a fail. Yeah. Um, hold on, hold on. Let me mark that condition. There we go. Yeah. Okay. Maybe. <laughs> a little, a little. Yeah. Plus dead. <laughs> Plus uh, dead. Our first casualty, because there's no way they can get out of this fire. Um, One of you all didn't even kill me. <laughs> I thought about shooting you in the head as I left the room. The environment got you. I needed. I my definitely shoot told you to kill me. To be honest with you. <laughs> uh, Hans, that, I was like, the, the rat, the rat has arrived. In the midst of all of those groupers, just work together to kill these things as friends and allies. First of all, bonus action, I would like to use uh, second wind to heal up a little bit. All right. Fuck, you're a fighter too. God damn it. <laughs> fighter and rogue. <laughs>
All right. And next, uh, has he noticed if the door is door down here is open now? Uh, you. Hold on. I'm deleting some of the spire because now that one is dead, it's out. Oh. <laughs> so, um, oh, you, you all see fail. That Here's is... your sympathy fire. When you go to like kind of like check when you go to check the lock, you notice that it is it is unlocked. All right, Hans is going to kind of let out a breath and go. All of a sudden, there was just fire everywhere. These actually helped us. I'm gonna get back out. He, uh, Yugi needs help. And should I roll deception? Um, that's up to the other players. That's their player agency. Do they think you're lying? I mean, I, I look. Grimble doesn't I mean, care. I, I've no. I will roll on insight against. That. Is he lying? I'll just roll insight. Thirteen. Yeah. Come on, Hans, lie to me. Tell me that sweet, sweet, sweet <laughs> lies. Ooh, I believe that. <laughs> tell eight, me eight. lies. Tell me sweet little lies. All right. Yeah, Gr oh, Grimble's oh. idea on this is I'm going out that door. I don't care about anyone else in this room. <laughs> yeah, so uh, Hans will uh, look at... So Hans will go through the door. And yeah, his last words to these uh, guys were to get the rat, so. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so Hans is going to GTFO. All right. I'll just, I'll just move you. <laughs> Thank you. Let me out! I can't get out! Oh, uh, right. Hans, it's like elevators with you. Gosh, come on. Okay, but yes. Yeah, so, uh, so that was his action to do that. Bonus action for that. And uh, yeah, Hans is GTFO. Yeah, that that was that was your turn. That, um. All right, let's see. Hi, I need a wisdom saving throw from Mr. Rat and a strength saving throw Harold. as well. Harold J. Rat. Here, here Harold J. Rat. 20. That's pretty solid. Right? You're not afraid. And strength is 11. All right. I need a dexterity it's saving fire. throw. It's fire. It just As fire. you get thrown <laughs> he died back him. into the fire. <laughs> Alright. You're gonna take you're gonna take half damage. So mad. <laughs> uh so eleven. Eleven fire damage. Mm -hmm. Um See what we get. Oh God! <laughs> You're uh, all over those fours and ones tonight. All over. Uh, yep. <clears throat> <sighs> no, I need something other than a four, please. Okay. Uh, Dex thirty saving throw. How many? Uh, one Dex, one Strength. Uh, Oof. ten Dex. Oops. All right, you are going to take. Then... 12 cold damage. Help and you, you're in the fire. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and you pass the strength save, so you stay in the fire. Okay. Bad. Bad. To the fire. Let's... Oh. Uh, I need another dexterity save. Now you get your damagey shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Funny. you. you... You pass on that, uh, and a uh, wisdom save. A lot of my gunslingers have high wisdom. Jesus Christ. 
Well, how long is he in the fire before that ammo starts popping off? Nine. <laughs> uh, that was your wisdom? You are afraid. You are afraid of this feller. Why? Why? This feller right. right here. So you cannot move closer to him. Stuck on the fire. On the door. Uh, Grimble. Yeah, I'm going out that door. You're gonna help. You're gonna help me, you fucker. <laughs> I helped you. Help me. <laughs> does it, it, does it open or did it relock? No, it's still open. It didn't close. Right, I, I'm out I, that door. <laughs> uh, before before he does, he's gonna take a drag off his candy cane cigarette and say, "Merry Merry fucking Christmas!" Flicking it. Walk out the door. Hi, Chef. Oh. Thank you so much for the raid. I hope your fundraiser is going really well. Um, I've just killed two people. One. Um, we're one. We killed one. I'm I working mean, on two more. I mean, you might as well so. say you killed two. Uh, hey, you know what? I'm giving you a chance. Right now. Roll me that nat 20. Uh, that ain't gonna happen. I mean... Never say that. Yeah, ever. that ain't happening. Miss Miracle? No. Right. Be there. no. Do, do, you wanna, do you wanna do you wanna do it? Or do you want me to? You're worse. What? Happening? Uh, we just got raided. Uh... No, 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 no. You... I mean, what do you, what, 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 what is the plan you have? Uh, Neop is, is dead. He is on fire and a bunch of gifts. Does the fire disappear now that he's dead? Nope. Yeah. Uh, However, the fire, I, I will point the fire is still there. <laughs> What's that? Theoretically, that door next to him is unlocked. Wait. And he can yeah, I have him. a plan. I have a plan to get out of here. Don't worry. Quiet. <laughs> Don't will the fire fire you will the fire you the fire think way of that that one is unlocked. Um, she was had alchemist fire within her, uh, the flask Al alchemist fire flask. Fire will not make that explode, right? Um, in this instance, do you want it to explode? I don't know. She's not keeping it inside any bag. Do you do you want it to explode? I would love it to explode. Yes. Okay. How much did it roll the damage for the alchemist fire as uh, the the fire gets bigger? One. Make the fire bigger. Two. Do I not? Do I not get three? You get two. whatever save the alchemist fire gets. Okay. Good. 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 Those are the three flasks he had, and it's a DC ten dexterity check. Dexterity the save. Flames. Oh, that way, that's just to extinguish it. It's, as an action, you can throw the flask up to 20 feet in, and it shatters on the impact. In this case, the fire may explode. And it's uh, 1d4 fire damage uh, at the start of the turn. It just it probably just made the fire bigger, that's it. Okay, so make me a dexterity saving throw. Got it. So mad. It's great. I'm, I, this is fantastic. <laughs> Ten fire damage. Oh wait, what is what is your DC save? Seventeen, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, in the spell. Ten yeah. fire damage. Oh yeah. I As the yeah. fire gets bigger. Uh, Ooh, and then the it's <laughs> the gazer's turn. What saves is it going to be against the rat? Uh, wisdom and strength. Floating 15, here like the wisdom. ships from... Okay. Uh, is that a save? Or the world. That, that, that <laughs> saves. Now you need a strength. Yeah, 17. You're 20. fine. You're good, you're good. Cool, cool, cool. And you're up. Cool. Uh, I'm I'm figuring it's the one at the very bottom, right? The one right in front of the door. Yeah, the one I'll right look. in front of the door. I'll shoot it. All right. Got a disadvantage? Yeah. But yes. 16. A six, 16 will hit. Maximum damage ah. 17. That's 
just enough damage. It's Excellent. dead. Pop. You are no longer does, afraid. Does Han still run, take the damage? Run, Barry, run! Uh, yes, Hans, <laughs> you take 17 psychic damage. Fuck you, Hans. I run um, 30 feet forward. <laughs> Kill him for me. And I will shoot this. This one here is dead as well, right? This I can't do. Yeah, this. is that halved or is it uh, can't resist that? How uh, you cannot resist? You can't resist a death blow. Okay, then Hans, as he's running away, he trips uh, as he gets that splitting headache and he falls to the ground. Okay. Um, I, I, I we throw one more attack. Okay. Uh, this the one next to me. It's dead already, right? I shot that one. That was the one, the two I shot when I came out of the door, right? Yeah, but none of them are dead. But you did shoot. You did shoot both of them. Yes. I thought, I thought one of them died. My, my bad. Never nope. Uh, I will shoot. I'll shoot the one right next to me. Okay. Uh, my bad. Gun jam. <laughs> Gun has jammed. Put it away, yep. pull my pistol. Um, that, I think... Let me just check what, I, what else I can do right now. How bad? How bad you looking, Felis? How bad uh, is Mr. Rat? I'm bloody. I have 28 out of 76. <laughs> um, I used... Fuck it. Bonus. I'm going to bite this thing. Bonus action, Hungry Jaws. Worked on uh, the upper roll me, a, roll me a D100. Did someone give you a... Oh, you... Mm, you have a villain point. 97. 79, my bad. 97. I read them um, wrong. You... You can... You can no longer fix that pistol. That you just jammed. My musket and... Whatever. Fuck. Yeah. It is unfixable in the situation that you are in right now. Well, bonus, bonus uh, action, Hungry Jaws. Yeah. Uh, to attack, natural 20. Look at that. I don't think that's going to hit. I don't think a natural 20 is going to hit. I think it does. Six damage against the one uh, against the one <laughs> closest to me. Yeah, it's it's still up. Cool. I get, uh, I, I get but points. Hans will take three psychic damage reduced to one. So I still take an auto failure because that was damage. If you are unconscious, yes. Yep. Kill him for me and I will die happy. You are dead. Uh, Hans, it's your turn. I will make a death saving throw. Roll a natural one for me, Misa, and I'll give you anything you want in our, in our Tuesday game I run. <laughs> oh, sorry, that's the success. Christmas. Fuck. <laughs> uh, and the door uh, shuts. Oh. What? Oh. <laughs> Why? What did I do? What happened? No. As the fire in the room, I got to get to the right thing, expands even more. Catching the presence under the table on fire, the whole room is just engulfed. Just the room is engulfed in flames, not, not Grimble. It doesn't uh, extend past right. the walls. <laughs> um, but I need, I need dexterity saving throws. I need you to give me a dexterity. Yeah, saving yeah. Throw. You're lucky I like you. Thank you. I'm assuming that was hoop. Uh, that's a 16. That is a failure. Okay. I, I, I might die. Yep. I die. I'm on, I'm dead. 28 points that's, of fire. I have damage. four hit points left. <laughs> <laughs> Because of my, of my, of my bite. Uh, sorry, Hans, did you, you rolled your death save? Um, roll me a d100. This is gonna be a... Me so bad. Aim high. It really is gonna be just one survivor. I mean, that's, the, I was gonna go there and shoot Hans. 
Uh, top half, 57. All right, um, you... I, if I get to the right thing. You regain one hit point. Oh. As one of the gazers that are inside the fire dies. I won't so they die by fire, and I get it. Health back? It died willingly. Right. I didn't even get to kill anyone. So Fuck. Hans will drag himself up, use half uh. of his movement to get himself up to uh, his feet, and look over at uh, Grimble and go, we should probably leave. I could use nap. Shoot him. Point the blank. Stab her. Stab <gasps> him. Claim your crown. Just cut it right here. Oh, oh, Nissa, you're muted again. How does Grimble look, by the way? Uh, I feel Seven, he's feeling me too. Sorry, I didn't catch that. Well, hey, I got 32 minutes left. Okay, so you're looking pretty good, so. Oh, you, you went a little robot again. Uh, can you hear me? Yeah. Oh, oh no. Oh my god. <laughs> No, you went all fucky. Oh. Oh no, the gremlins. <laughs> I've been using this for about 12 hours. Um. Yeah. I'm gonna cast it at second level. Oh, well, it's Hans. Are you done? Uh, no, not quite yet. Okay, it's not. It's not quite your turn. We were just asking how much health you have. Yeah, I was just in quiet. I was making conversation. Like, how are you looking, man? Well, I thought, didn't Hans go and then, and then Harold went. That is the end of Hans's turn with with the natural twenty. You make it that save at the end of your turn. No, no if no. he it, it's at the start of the turn, and if he makes a natural twenty, he gets to act. But also, he didn't roll death save. He got saved by one of his things dying for him. So I'm no longer making death saves. Yes. Yeah, yeah. so then they wouldn't be yeah. Would just be a turn. This is entirely moot. Mm -hmm. So yeah, Hans is gonna put the gun away and give a tired smile to Grimble and went, we should probably leave. Yes? And uh, that will be... Just checking my things here. You oh, know what? That's, right. that's gonna try to be a uh, either a persuasion a DM of what, what do you think? Should that be a persuasion or a deception? What are you trying to do? Not get killed by Grimble. Uh, that's that's not up to the DM. That is up to Grimble. Okay. That is player right. agency uh, right there. So you know what? I will try to do a a persuasion roll for him to, you know, not kill me. I can be a friend. Technically, you can't make social rolls against other players. You just have to be convincing. Mhm. Mm okay. So I will. Use the dodge action and just uh, conversationally go, we should probably leave. And using the rest of my 15 feet of movement to solely move away from the door. And we'll say you're kind of effectively off the map right now. Yeah. But we'll say that you're far enough away. Uh, this gazer 
This geyser... Uh... Harold, you see this geyser just... Burr, disappear out of out of sight. And it'll reappear right next to Gruber. <laughs> uh, Grimble! You know what? You're out of the fire. You're safe. Healer. Yeah. You you heard Hans uh, saying that the, these uh, gazers were helping. That's true. Uh, Grimble is going to cautiously move. Uh, he's going to leave just in an opposite direction from Hans. Awesome. He's he's making his way. He he knows the North Pole and its environs pretty well. He he can he can make himself. He can get someplace safe. <clears throat> yeah, he's, you can. He, he's, This may not be it's, your it's, North Pole. That's true. But you know the but, North Pole. I, yeah, I, I know. I know the. I know the Arctic Circle. I'm pretty. I'm pretty good with it. This geyser. This geyser is also going to disappear. And so is this one. Harold, you're in a room by yourself, completely mm -hmm. on fire. Yes. Yeah. What would you like to do? All of the um, doors are closed. I just want to see something. Okay, so I can't do that. Okay. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to go over to the window. Okay. Can I see Hans? Um, you can see, you can see Hans way off in the distance. How far away? I thought there was no window in that room. Oh Anyone yeah, there is here? no window. The that's window not there? a window. No, oh, that's not that a window. Case, fuck it, I'm, I'm just gonna, uh, fucking, I'm just gonna go here. Try to open the door. Doesn't open. Is there any <laughs> words? How, how, what? No words. Uh, yeah, you know what? There are words. There are words when you go to try to open it. Blair was here. <sighs> Thank you, Blair. Hope, Thank hope, you, Neon no. Lights, for the raid. All Someone right. is about to die. You got here just in time. You see, if Pons was still down when my turn started, it was Witch Bolt all the way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> e -B -K -B -B. I have nothing I can do. I, 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 can I try to break down the door, maybe? Do you, I, do you have you have an axe? Can I try to break down the door? Make me a strength check. Okay, I'm going to remove that condition I gave myself. <laughs> <laughs> um, you have to death. <laughs> This is not great. I have a plus zero to this. Nope. Ooh. Nope. You you get this small little hand axe and you start chipping away and it's not doing no. much of anything. Harold dies. And Harold, Harold dies. dies to the fire. You have killed every PC. I have killed every PC. I was I gave you guys I gave you guys three hours to kill each other. It works together. The power of D and D. Yeah. You know. Um, you know. I. I feel like you misrepresented this because you said we did have to work together. We couldn't just kill each other right from the start. So. Well, you guys I, also weren't supposed to split the party and start two encounters at the same time. To be fair, we didn't split the party. They split the party. <laughs> um, <laughs> but Hans, you and your gazer. Um, are able to get to the other side of the North Pole and you see this tree that's like all of the lights have like this nice shimmering uh, glow about it but this one has just like it looks a little translucent like it moves a little weird and you hear a voice in your head and kind of like a mental nudge go through Go through. You know what? Ahans is tired. He's gonna go through. 
So you go through this tree, um, and your little gazer friend is right there with you, hovering at I, your shoulder. My mini Gruber. Your mini Gruber. Um, and what you two see is basically what you saw at the beginning. You're in Santa's village. His house is on fire. The big house is on fire. And you can't move. And we're going to leave you there for just a second as we go to, uh, to Grimble. Who went off in another direction. Because you know, you know the North Pole. Um, but you don't find a tree. You know how to get out of here. There's a tunnel. There's always a tunnel. You just got to find the right candy cane. You go through the tunnel. And when you come out the other side, much like Gruber, you're back at the tree. Son you can see biscuit. Gruber and his mini Gruber. Mm -hmm. The um, the big house is on fire. It doesn't seem to be spreading, but it just it looks like a illusory fire. Neither of you can move. You feel like this isn't the end of the naughty list. I think that's what I'm for you. <laughs> Kill Gruber. I Shoot think... him now. <laughs> I think, uh... Mini Gruber's the real MVP. Kill Gruber to death. I think that's where we're going to end tonight. Our I'm two so survivors. Mad in so many ways. It was lots of fun, but I'm so mad. <laughs> I Welcome made Hans the with the full intention of him getting killed like within 10 minutes. Holy crap. <laughs> I am going. Yeah. The phone is going to get you next week. The dice have chosen Nisa as the survivor. Nisa Thank Anna. you, High Shelf Collective, for the raid. Yeah, hello. And uh, Blair for helping me kill another player. Uh, thank you, Neon Lights, for the raid as well. Um, we hope to see you back. Uh, uh, Grimble and Hans will return in January to see where this, uh, this tale leads. But uh, two weeks, we have a new set of... Uh, tributes to see how they get through Santa's village. Santa's a psycho, y'all. <laughs> yeah, if one doesn't kill Gruber in two weeks, I'm going to come for you. <laughs> Harsh words and, and, a, and an angry temperament. I will spend as many billion points as is yeah. possible. I'm going to fucking binge watch everything between now and then. So I can There's your challenge, people. Give enough uh...